What is up, hey, comic every fans? Time I see that, it's a more and more bad A, Fry. Yeah. More and more yeah. bad A. More yeah, I love that. I'm a big fan already. Just saying hello, guys, and that, that is that is an amazing epic intro based on the fact that we make animated intros. I am very impressed. Nice. <laughs> love it. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> You're just like, oh yeah, oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> This, this frag guy, this frag guy might have something here. Well, hey, everybody, Crypto Comics Nation, thank you so much for joining us tonight or today. Or yesterday or tomorrow. Or tomorrow. Yeah, that's right. Oh, my gosh. It gets complex. It gets complex. We're with Sean Keaton of Comics to Movies. Da, 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 the great Sean Keaton. Oh, thank you very much, mate. Uh, what a what a way, what an intro that is! Uh, fantastic. G'day, guys. Uh, super excited to to be here for the US live launch. Uh, the first time Crypto Comics has done something like this. So uh, we've got some extra little special things that we're going to to do throughout the show. So make sure you uh, tune in and uh, listen and uh, enjoy yourself. Uh, have a have a great night uh, or day wherever you are. Yeah. <laughs> and we have Elfie, Agent Coil. Did I say that right? You did. Right on. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Got in one. Yeah. Thank you. Hello, everyone. I'm from Lightmare Studios, founding uh, and creative director of Lightmare. So we make video games, and particularly we make games out of cards. So, yeah. And now comics. <laughs> nice. <laughs> right. So this is now. Now this is the first Australian comic. Two game crossover. That is correct, right? Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Woo! That's right. pretty incredible, 100%, guys. Hundred percent. <laughs> <laughs> Jumping in chat. OTDA says, "What's up, y'all?" And then tells me that my mic was too loud, so I turned it down a little bit. Hopefully, it's better. These guys already made me turn it down a little. I've been telling them that OTDA all before we got on. I'm like, "Hey, Fry, you're kind of scratchy in my ear." Fry sounds perfect. I don't know what everybody's really complaining about. <laughs> OTDA says cheers. So, let's get right into it, shall we? Let's let everybody Definitely. know what we're here for. What do you guys say? Do we just go right to the big thing, or do we talk about well, well, the think, other I big thing? Good. I think it would Hold be up. good for um for Bro, LPM. You're still too loud. Psh. Yeah, <laughs> Bri, you got to really turn loud, down, dude. Actually, I mean, dude. I know you want to be. The He's cranked way player. down. He is cranked uh -huh. way down. He's using new software tonight. Can I grab a sharing link as well? I want to throw it out to my, my social media guy to pop it out on the internet. So I don't know yeah. if you can do a live sharing link of it. I'm still getting used to this. Yeah, so. absolutely. Uh, YouTube.com slash Crypto Comics Marketplace is probably the best bet. I'm going to okay. throw that into chat right now. Da -da -da. Yeah. Everybody says you're still loud, Fry. I'm sorry, man. Yep. Jeez. You're yeah, just not why it's, compared to everyone else, you're, you're coming through like 10, like level 10. Yeah. So. <laughs> level 11. <laughs> he, he wanted to be the star, and so he's making sure. I mean, I can I can him. make sure to crank it real loud if we need to, but. No, well, no, he's in no, the no. center, so. <laughs> no. I'll try not to. It's it's hurting already. Chat will let me know if it's still too loud, so. No more it's been, We're turned down to like. We're at fourteen percent right now. Go so down to like ten. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't know what that means. So don't. Don't do. All right. I don't know what that means. It's know. an. It's an analog dial. Okay. It's oh, really okay, hard yeah, to get it right on ten. Don't play with that stuff, man. Uh, yeah, Elfie, I just threw a link right there into chat. Uh, in the main chat, right. if you need it in the private chat, let me know. So, so what I'm what I'm interested in is, um, Sean, Elfie, kind of tell us like. How you guys met, met up and how this idea kind of got going and stuff. I mean, let's let's talk about the birth of the first crossover in Australian history. Well, you that's, that's it's really, it's yeah, really funny because um we uh had talked about this this before and it's like any relationship, uh, different people have different um you know versions of how they met. Like the version I tell everyone about how I met what my wife is not the version she tells everybody. So, um, but, uh, let's hear her version first. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> 
but um, in regards to, to, to meeting Alfie and how we got um, uh, into this, it literally had nothing to do with the, the, the comic at all. We were at a, a local comic convention um, up in, in Brisbane, uh, but both of us are actually uh, from Melbourne, which is down south of, uh, of Australia. Um, Alfie was there for his game company. I was there for, for my comic book company, and um, they had this really awesome game, Infinity Heroes, and uh, we got talking in regards to, um, you know, what universes could come into the game and, uh, you know, cross, cross over and, and play within the, within the game. But it wasn't until we'd gone through about six months of back and forth of how the IP would work within the, within the game and everything that when I finally signed on and, and said, yep, I want to be a part of this and everything, that um, Alfie was like, well, how, how do we get your fandom in, introduced and interested in um, in the game? And I was like, let's do a, a crossover comic. How cool would that be? And it was something that we had not talked about in the six months leading up to it. Um, and then, you know, everything pretty much um, snowballed very quickly from from then, uh, we got a, f a few pages done by um, the XCT artist. Uh, we, we set up the pre-launch page, and um, you know now we're now we're going live. So that's my version, but uh, I'll let uh, Alfie tell tell his. So. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, I uh, we've done a few crossovers in the past. So um, we actually partnered with Star Trek: The Next Generation for Infinity Wars, um, and did like the first. We had the global rights to their um, first. We had the global rights to their uh, their IP. And um, and then we've also uh, part of the Luminous Agents, which is another Australian IP, um, and they, they have like this fantasy IP that they, they do. They've also got also got a comic as well, but it's uh, not not as comic centered as uh, as Sean's is. So um, when I was just walking through, look, I'm a big big crossover fan. I was I still listen to mashups all the time on on on, the, on YouTube, and and I've always been I've been a model when I was younger as well. So very big into like crossing things over, um, and. One of the inspirations for Infinity Wars is actually HeroScape, which has got all these crazy different people from different mm -hmm. timelines and things like that. So when I saw Sean stand, I was like, wow. Like he has these really cool images of like these um, like half and half faces of, of different pop culture IPs and stuff. So um, I'm very, very amazed by that. And then, um, yeah, then we started talking and uh, and I thought, yeah, let's let's have let's have Spartacus in the game. And then, like Sean said, later on, we thought, why don't we just put him in the Put him in the game, not just uh, sorry, make a move, make a comic, um, rather than just uh, make a game of him. So, yeah, that's the direction we're going in, and it's just it's just worked so so well. Just seeing the way that it works it plausibly in the I, I don't know if you guys are going to play the uh, the Kickstarter trailer, but like the way it works plausibly in the universe really makes a lot of sense. Like it could just be a really wild acid trip, or a you know um, it could just be a really really crazy dream that uh, that Spartacus has had, or there could be these portals that have opened up and and taken him to another universe. So, so, so yeah. is the so is the comic going to tell a story to kind of set the scene for the game, or is uh, how how how's that going to yeah. work? Yeah. So actually, we've got uh, for the game we have uh, we have a bit of a road to XCT kind of crossover stories. So we have these sort of origin or lead up stories to the comic from the Infinity side of things for the characters oh, that are featuring from the cool, Infinity side. Okay. Um, yeah, and then so far with 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 uh, with uh, um, XCT, like I said, to be able to keep it plausible uh, both ways for the people who are purists and the people who are wanting those mashups and crossovers. Um, he he does wake up in the middle of the night and goes to the goes to the bathroom and then suddenly ends up in a portal. So, oh, yeah. Well, yeah. Did we just get, well, did we just get like an alert? Was that an alert? Was that a spoiler alert? Wait. No, it wasn't a spoiler. It, it, was, it, was, it was an alert. Definitely an alert. <laughs> uh, no, so on, on the on the um, Kickstarter, you'll be able to see the first five pages, which does the lead up. So um, oh, awesome. the part that we really wanted to make sure that was... Mm -hmm we were actually telling a good story and that we weren't just doing this for fan service or for the the sake of doing this or a marketing thing so one thing that we're really passionate about is telling a, a good story a plausible story in both universes and everything so alfie's right. done a great job um leading up to to where um infinity heroes is and then it was fairly easy with with xct um we've literally you know just got spartacus waking up in the middle of the night and then getting dropped straight in the the middle of uh the action so um i do have to um you know, 
Yeah, I do have to, to give a shout out to, to um, uh, my writer Ben Rosenthal. He does a great job in um, you know coming up with these ideas and, and being able to um, merge the, the two quite quite well. So um, he's been really good around um, this this crossover and, and uh, fleshing it out to where both of us are really really happy with what we've produced. Fantastic. That's awesome. Now, the, the comic page you're talking about, those are ones that you get when you join the Kickstarter. Hey, Fry, should we should we head over to the Kickstarter uh, page? Yes, on one second, though. One sec. Let's catch up with chat here real quick. Oh, so, Sorry, let's guys. see. We got Rose on, so that means we've got just about every continent covered other than Africa today. Butterscotch! So, day. so, it's Happy yeah, Batman Day, Rose. Butterscotch Pudding Day, Oktoberfest Day. Wow. That's a lot of days. Dude! <laughs> yes! It's also I Super Kickstarter Lunch Day. Butterscotch pudding day but i love butterscotch pudding <laughs> i but know i feel like we should have celebrated this uh house Lovers on youtube says hey everyone um and then goes on to say thanks for the reminder da da says i got you they're just having a conversation with each other it looks like yeah, so just ignore <laughs> me why don't you <laughs> let's see says got one on youtube says hi everyone everybody's telling cheers to sassy girl everybody's cheers laughing at elfie and everything he's saying. Cheers! <laughs> so let's see, uh, real quick before we do that, I prepared, prepared the video so that we can uh, showcase exactly what Infinity Heroes is. Um, give people a little bit of an idea. This is the video that's featured on the Kickstarter, but I think this kind of explains a little bit as to what everybody's talking about right now if you're not hey, familiar yeah, with, right, with right. these types of games. I know what the problem is, dude. I think I know what the problem is, man. You shaved so your voice is transferring it's just coming out it's coming out it's it's a it's a it's a cleaner protocol normally you have something there to kind of take some of the volume down i think that's what the problem is i think just an idea just an idea everybody look how beautiful fry is oh <laughs> baby face fry okay let's show this video <laughs> what is infinity heroes Infinity Heroes is a simultaneous turn-based competitive strategy card game. Sorry guys, might want to go to the other video. Cards, pre-constructed decks, and Okay, now we want to do a different video. The, the one that's I don't know why why that's mm -hmm. on the Kickstarter. That shouldn't be the no, Kickstarter main video. So right? that's just to explain the game, and then yep. we're gonna go into the crossover between the game and the comic. Ah. <laughs> okay, cool. Sorry, I'm not. With it. <laughs> Up. I'm like, oh my god, did I grab the wrong video? That's the right video. That's the right video. Checking us. I thought for sure I had the wrong video. I don't want anyone to know about my game. What are you talking about, guys? Oh man, okay, I'm gonna restart this now because you just terrified the crap out of me. What is Infinity Heroes? Infinity Heroes is a simultaneous turn-based competitive strategy card game. With beautifully animated cards, pre-constructed decks, an elegant battlefield, and a fully customizable in-game hero designer, Infinity Heroes promises a whole new card playing experience. But what does that mean? Let's break it down. In traditional card games, each player takes a turn on their own time. This is where Infinity Heroes differs. Players initiate their planning phases simultaneously, with everything resolving at once. In this system, based on our previous game Infinity Wars, a whole new level of strategy has been added to the game, forcing players to predict and outmaneuver their opponents. Zones play into this quite heavily. There's the support zone, where cards are initially deployed. This area is quite safe and protects players from the majority of spells and effects. Then there's the Assault and Defense Zones. At the end of each turn, Assault Zone units will attack, while Defense Zone units will be there to stop and intercept their attacks. This can lead to some advanced gameplay. For example, if a player knows when their opponent is going to play a spell to damage a large attacking unit, they can move them into the Support Zone for safety. Their opponent's spell will fail, and they'll be able to retain their attacking unit. Awesome! Deck building is hard, we get it, so we've developed a solution, pre-constructed decks. Each hero deck has four units, two spells, one ultimate unit, one ultimate spell, and a hero power. Players can pick three heroes for their lineup. 
As each turn begins, players can pick a hero from their lineup to take into that turn. The hero selected will determine which cards are drawn for that turn, what ultimates are accessed, and the hero power. This allows multiple strengths in your lineup, so players can adapt their gameplay strategies as the game progresses. What about hero design? Between the aggression of Iberian, the control of Candid, and the board presence of Patient Zero, there's plenty to choose from. For something a little more customized, our in-game hero deck designer allows artwork to be uploaded and applied to players' cards. From there, players will be able to name heroes, set their power levels and costs, and give them effects. Artwork will require approval before being published in order to avoid inappropriate images or breaches of privacy. For something a little more scaled back, decks can be made with different values and effects with hundreds of animated templates to choose from. Infinity Heroes will be free to play on PC and mobile. Get in early to unlock a bunch of other goodies by backing our Kickstarter. For our biggest supporters, we're providing an opportunity to work right alongside with our designers to craft a fully animated hero card and a deck based on our biggest hero, you. Whether you want to be the best, bring your creations to life, or just have a great time destroying your friends, Infinity Heroes has something for you. Heed the call, become an Infinity Hero today. Oh, That's yeah, awesome. looks like we got Ben on now too. Hey Ben, how are we going? I, I was hiding, but hello, here I am. <laughs> Smart! What's up, Ben? Oh, you know. So, I, I just so, got kicked in the head. So Ben's the amazing uh, writer on the series. So he's uh, he's been fantastic. He's taken up writing duties over the last two graphic novels um, for the XCT series and has done a great job on XCT Infinity, as well as he uh, is super into wrestling. So he's actually a manager for a wrestler and uh, has uh, done a little bit of wrestling himself. Not that I would call it wrestling, but he got his well, ass now, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Is it, is it, you were a wrestler or you just worked with wrestling? Uh, so I, I've worked with the wrestling industry in South Australia for uh, 13 years, um, doing booking and, and uh, being a manager and a commentator. Uh, and Whoa. then, uh, yeah, I, I wrestled my first match last year, December last year. Um, you know, just because of that, I, Weasley bad guy, I pretty much just... What, what, what was your wrestler name and outfit? Was it cosplay-ish? Uh, no. I <laughs> a, a tweed jacket with an up shirt and just pants. Uh, and oh. the payoff was when I got in the ring, I was still wearing that. And I got in the ring and took off my jacket. The arms of the butt were cut off. And I, I tried to look intimidating, but it just looked like a weak gimp. Uh, which, uh, <laughs> got, got the correct reaction. <laughs> nice. That's fantastic. Uh, all it's all a part of the plan, right, Ben? It's that's right. Yeah, yeah. My job is to make the good guys look good. So damn uh, right. It, it's not hard with a face like this. Hey, we, we and that's appreciate. what he does with me and XCT. <laughs> we right. <laughs> That, so, yeah. so you're, you're the you're the writer and you're the person who wrote the the crossover story. Yeah, yeah. So uh, Sean came to me and asked if I wanted to do it, and I've always wanted to write a, a, a crossover. Um, purely as well because I'm a I was a big X Men reader, and XCT I'm I'm sort of writing like X Men, and when an opportunity came to write a crossover, I thought, well, that that's the next natural step, isn't it? You, you'd write X Men, and then uh, yeah, that comes up. Uh, yeah, it, was, it took a while to get my head around the characters. Um, a lot more difficult when you're dealing with someone else's characters as well because you, you don't know what's in store for them and you might have ideas that are completely contradictory to what uh, the creators actually have uh, in store for them. Um, so, yeah, it was a challenge, but I really enjoyed it. Uh, a good challenge. As well, it sounds to like ones. you did well on that challenge. I hope so. And writing, um, writing super hard, Matt can tell you. <laughs> tells me all the time. Um, yeah, it is. It is. Uh, but rewarding as well. Um, much, much like art. Uh, it, it's it's good to see that final product there, and, and even better to see people actually enjoying it. So that's uh, yeah. What I, what I words and stuff. 
I'm just going to drink my coffee. <laughs> and, and I do have to say the the first book uh, that Ben wrote in the uh, XCT series, Breakout, is actually up for an award at the end of this year at a um, film industry uh, award for uh, best comic. So he's very modest, uh, but he's a, a very talented uh, writer. So nice. yes, yeah. where do we go vote oh, for that? Uh, it is uh, an independent vote, so it's um, we can't uh, unfortunately go and vote ourselves or ourselves. We can't got rig my it. Family is what all over. What? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but we find out in December how we how we went with that. So we need um, to write a letter. Letters do right. things. Well, <laughs> over here on chat, uh, yeah, we got. Uh, yeah, I was laughing at uh, Elfie talking about the acid trip. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, Andrew is, uh, we know Jesse I'm trying not to talk too much man it's just my boisterous voice <laughs> we're, we're trying to get this figured out I sent Fry a message saying put the microphone in another room and hopefully it'll be okay uh, <laughs> so we have the footage from that video looks uh, so old now compared to the updates and progress over the last year uh, yeah it really does that's actually um, what you guys have done Thanks, well, thanks. Well, it's actually my uh, my community guy there piping in, so it's great that he's nice. on our channel and stuff, which is really cool. Um, but yeah, it's uh, it's super super updated. I mean, like I've got even a uh, an example on screen now of what it looks like today, and it's like yeah, it's a bit different to what you just saw a moment ago. Is the um, XCT Infinity Kickstarter video a newer one? Is that a better one uh, to use? That is a newer one, but yes. just, I yep. might even just uh, share my screen for two seconds to you guys and just show you what like yeah, just a little bit screen. about what it's been up to now so this is what the game looks like in game miles will give you a quick preview on that so we've done a bit on the on the backgrounds there you can see spartacus yeah. rocking it oh, now no, i wait now i didn't even get spartacus as an option what the did i get a bunk code <laughs> oh no 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 you didn't get a dodgy version he's not yeah. gonna be revealed well he's re he was revealed last night well, so this is now, he's revealed. now he's yeah. revealed now he's revealed we've actually <laughs> shown off like, uh, spartacus oh. right now second time in the world so yeah, yeah, yeah. This is this is him in game, um, and you can see the blue tiger as well. Hey, okay, what does he cards. get? Hover over him. I want to see what he gives real quick, just real quick. Oh yeah, I want to see what he gives. <laughs> Give a friendly attack. Yo, hell yeah! yeah. <laughs> nice, dude. That could have yeah. come in handy today while I was getting slaughtered. Right? How about this? <laughs> Looney's ultimate unit. There we go. Son Rider, flying, end, deal one damage to all enemy combat units. At the end of every turn, deal one damage to all enemy combat units and give plus one, plus zero to all friendly combat units. 10, 10. Is that something that Spartacus gets to bring out? Because I never saw anything yeah, that nice. Yeah, that's a Spartacus unique um, oh, ultimate oh, unit. Oh, so, yeah, every, every cool. character gets nice. an ultimate unit Very and cool. an nice, ultimate John. spell. Yeah, yeah, it's it's. It, I, I love that dragon because I named him after my nephew. So my my <laughs> nephew's called Sunny Rider. Um, so we combined that together and called it Sun Rider as the dragon. So um, he was he was he was super stoked and and was telling all of his friends he's going to be in a, a video game and and everything. So I got all messages this morning from him and his friends going, "How do I get the game? I want the game. I want to play Sunny." So it's really cool. So it really yeah. is a fun game to play. I like. I got on and, and it took me a minute to kind of figure out some stuff, and I still don't know a lot. Trust me. But man, you get into it, and I, I've won a few. I've won like three or four, maybe oh, out of wow. seven. Sometimes mm -hmm. the AI I think is being nice to me because other times it does give you a good time like, every now and then. It's like, oh, dude, yeah, let's, let's go really easy on like you. Brutal. I was like, that's not fair. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it does scale as well. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. So the um, the Warcry is an example of Spartacus's ultimate ability, which oh. is cost seven to bring out. Every friendly unit fights a random hero or unit, <laughs> and heroes oh. don't fight back. <laughs> so it's like send in everyone, right? Like, yeah. That is oh, dirty. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And I, and I do have to, to say thank you to David Jackson, who did all the artwork um, on on these cards, which is which is phenomenal. He's done a, a great job. And then um, the uh, lady from uh, Lightmare Studios, who actually animated all the cards, which is super exciting to see when when I when I get it back, like the laser shooting, and oh, it's like uh, it's it's very very cool to to see your um your creations not only in a game but animated like that. And, um, yeah. yeah, very very cool. There you so go. we have a question over here on the chat. Let me see. Uh, where and how much? Uh, 
Well, the best way to get a copy of the game at the moment is to go and uh, sponsor it on the Kickstarter, which will give you a let's free copy of the game. Let's go to the Kickstarter page, Fry. Right there. Oh, we can do that. Let, yeah. let, let's go to the Kickstarter page right now, and that way we can showcase people where to go, um, because we really, oh, really, really want <laughs> this to get to get funded, guys. I mean, this uh, is... different, different one, guys. We're looking for oh, oh that's She's... the old one. Let's let's go back on that one. We want to find right. the XTT Infinity. You want to drop the um the link in there into private it's chat? Up, up the top of the left hand side. Oh, us. you you want to use the Infinity right. one? Okay, yeah. there we can do we that. Go. Yep, yep. XCT Infinity. Yep. So that's the so best way to get the game. So which one's in the moment. chat right now, Fry? Ah, I think I probably put the old one in the chat. We got so many links here. Hold on. Don't, don't listen to Fry in chat. He obviously did not understand what to put in chat. So just nope. disregard that and put in the, oh, the new one's there. We saved it. <laughs> I'm just oh, going off of what I backed here, guys, okay? <laughs> <It's> just... <Yeah. laughs> you backed Sorry. the wrong one on live? No, 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 no. <laughs> he, he, he backed the right one. The other one's, the other one's finished and everything. So that, yeah, oh, it wouldn't, it wouldn't let this, you do it. Yeah, okay. yeah this, oh, this is gosh. definitely the right one. So um, we've got everything starts from $5 for just a digital comic if people um, just want to, to back the, the comic. Um, but if you want the game in the comic, that's starts at $30 so you get access to the game you get um, the hero unlock of Spartacus, you get his deck uh, and you get the PDF copy of the, the comic for $30 so um, and that's Australian so I think that works out to be about um, $2.50 uh, American there we go how much? $2.50 American that, that was a joke. Yes! I, was, I, I love now. this ratio. Are you serious? Oh, Let's uh, do this. one sec, guys. Hey, Coyle, can you just give a thumbs up to the camera real quick so I can make sure that that's working? Uh, are you doing that for the leak? Because uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm sitting there going, "What do you know, want to leak?" I don't know what you're doing. I don't know what you're talking what about. Anyone wants to leak before he does it? But I tell you what, I'm going to do a thumbs up. And oh, there, there we go. <laughs> See what happens. I was literally just checking with him. I'm like, hmm. What do you I, want I thought I'd, I thought I'd catch you on that one. I thought I'd catch <laughs> you, you slipping. You, you almost did, mate. But I'll, I'll let you have it. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know how he's going to do that. So maybe just uh, if you want to, they can leak it right there in the YouTube chat, and we'll just put it right up on the screen. It's probably it's probably that I have my own hero card. I love it when things get leaked. It's like. <laughs> Spoiler alert! So, uh, what platform can you actually play all uh, the games on? Oh, fun thing I can spoil. Regarding the short series we have, one will be launching within the next week. I won't say if it ties into XCT or not, but keep an eye out. What? Wow. So, Sean, I'm going to need you to nod if it ties into XCT. I don't know okay, much Sean, of a leak. Just, I just, blink, I'm kind of disappointed blink, by my own guy's blink. leak. <laughs> Not much of a leak. How about I leak it? Here we go. So, <laughs> <laughs> um, I could say that. Not this uh, one coming out, but the, definitely the one straight after that. And we will now leak it in the We will now launch it in the next week. Um, will definitely be a tie-in to the XCT. It will be um, just before one of the characters um, comes and, and meets up uh, with Spartacus. So, yeah. Ooh, there, will be, there will be an XCT what? comic one coming we in. We got some meeting up going on? A little bit yeah. of... Yeah, for the record, yeah. right, for the I'm record, coming. Jared, spoiler, that spoiler? that's an that's an okay spoiler for the show, Jared. Oh man, what, <laughs> unlike what yours. Are you trying to say, hey, I got, I got, I got to ask this. So, um, dumb question: Is a pledge a one-time thing or a monthly thing? Not a dumb question. Uh, Kickstarter, if you've never used it before, is a one-time off pledge. Um, program so it's almost like a pre-order uh program so you pledge for the rewards you want uh on the right hand side of the the screen uh there's different uh things that you get for each reward you do not get charged until the end of the campaign um so you can change it at any time but um you know also if you want to back and back early which is what we always ask um fans to do uh because it helps us with all the algorithms and staying 
playing up in Kickstarter and being seen, uh, but you can change it and you don't get charged until the end of the 30 days. So for us, uh, the campaign doesn't end until the 18th of October. So you can pledge today, but the money actually won't come out until the 18th of October and except all major credit cards and all that type of stuff. It's quite a secure site. Um, so yeah, if you haven't used Kickstarter before, that's what you can, you can do. And there's some really, really cool options that you guys have put into this thing. I mean, I'm, I'm like kind of taken back. It took me a minute and I had to ask Sean before the stream started, which one I actually wanted because <laughs> it gets a little crazy, but, um, so for there's example, that, sorry. Just, yes. Oh, cool. There's the, there's the pages. Whoa, whoa. We got a bunch of people talking. What's going on? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I was staring at the screen and, and sidetracked everybody. What did you say? Was it Elfie was talking to you? No, it was Ben. I think it was Ben. Oh, yeah. Ben. Go, go ahead, I tried to, tried to make a really great joke, and uh, to, to say it now would just be to look foolish. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> so, not a dick I am. I'm sorry, dude. Uh, no, no, not at all. It, it was an awful joke and uh, not worth repeating, but we'll just pretend that it was great and uh, hilarious. Here, you, you'll quick, find that quick. Jared is like this a lot, Ben. Uh, you know, and we, we have to um, exit him from the, the stream sometimes when he uh, yeah, no, 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 goes off track. No, 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 everybody. No, no, no. Just, 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 just have a chuckle real quick. Don't don't worry, guys. Jared still isn't sure that we can't uh, edit a live stream. He doesn't quite understand it yet, so he thinks yes, I'm just going to edit those together. Yes, yes, he can. <laughs> if something goes wrong, don't worry. We'll just take it out <laughs> and repost a good shot, right? Yep, that's right, Jared. I never that's worry. Right. Just no be yourself, man. Hurry, no worry. Yeah, so, I mean, based on the different levels, you've got, it starts out, you get, like, the PDFs, you get the full collection PDFs, you get access to the beta of the game. I mean, it just builds and builds and builds to the point of where, like, I mean, which one here? You can be a hero or a villain in the game itself, oh, which is cool. pretty rad. So that's, that's not just the game, it's actually in the comic and the game. So you, you turn up and rock up in a future issue of the, the series as a villain, uh, and then you get to, to be uh, transferred into the game, and uh, yeah, there's a deck and everything that will be made off uh, either some uh, cards that are already there, but you'll have your own own hero card um, within, the, within the game, which is really cool. So... Um, the hero one has already gone, so uh, there's there's only the villain one left, um, and that is uh, 950 Australian, um, which is about 30 to 35 percent cheaper in the, in US dollars type of thing. So, um, but it is a, a really cool uh, cool reward. Our goal is 6,000 Australian dollars to raise uh, for this, so that will produce the comic, uh, print the comic, and and uh, ship it all out to to everyone. Um, but yeah, as we said. The, the cheapest rewards are five dollars and nine dollars uh, for the PDFs. Uh, if mm -hmm. we can get over two and a half thousand dollars on this stream, um, that nine dollar PDF pack, we will add another two comics into it, uh, free of charge. So if we can get over two and a half thousand during the the stream, uh, which I think we're at about two three at the at the moment. Let's so, see. Um, Oh, it's it's showing me in in US dollars. So let's see, you're at two thousand three hundred eleven dollars and thirty two cents in Australian right now. Oh there there you go. Right so right if we can get down. if we can get two hundred bucks uh, um, while we're on on live, uh, we'll add another two free comics. Uh, that's into that PDF pack. So not only the nine dollar reward gets it, but every single um, tier uh, after that gets it as well. So. Someone needs to just jump in and drop that 200 bucks because hey, I, I, I want more comments. Like, it was such, right, man, such a man, moment when right. the, uh, the Become a Hero got launched at like live, when we were just about to reveal the tier of Become a Hero, Become a Villain. And as we went down to it, someone's like, someone's already bought it. So there was, the hero is already gone. Um, <laughs> so we hadn't even been able then, to describe it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we couldn't even get a chance to describe it. Um, and we, we also decided on the live stream last time that we're going to actually get the first draft of each the hero and the villain done up in art. They won't be animated, but they'll be done up in, in a still. And, uh, and for the close of the XCT Infinity Kickstarter, we're actually going to do like a versus match where they're going to go upload their characters into the game and have a versus match. Because oh, you can actually upload 
any image we'll do, you want into the game. And we'll do Ooh. that on a live. And we'll do that on a live stream. So uh, right. for the end of the end of the Kickstarter. So we thought that would be something cool. So, um, so yeah. So Adam was the the guy that got the hero one. So we'll just wait until we get that villain one done, and then we'll tee up a time to to make them fight off against each other live for the the ending of the the, the Kickstarter. So. So Dominic and chat just did the math. It's six hundred ninety-two dollars and sixty-five cents US dollars to be the villain. Yeah, which means that you would spend you would spend yeah. dramatically less than Lex, Lex Luthor. So I mean the value is there. Lex Luthor. Yeah. Yeah. Gentlemen, it might be worth playing the uh, the the trailer at the top, the two minute trailer up the top there. Um, that actually it, like it says a, says a nice Spice. gives a nice expose of it and it actually shows some animated panels as well that our animator went through and animated some of the comic book panels a little bit as well there Ooh. so that might be worth a little bit of play for everyone on the stream yeah do you have them yeah so you should be able to uh, just if you go to the links in the private chat I've just linked you to the private video which actually will just play the video if you just want to play it on YouTube um, I'm there. not seeing it in the private chat yet it might be just have a little bit of a delay there. here just down the bottom. Oh, there, there go. we go. Now I see it. Okay, give me just a second, and I will oh, grab that what from. Is a delay. So <laughs> while he's uh, uploading that, <clears throat> I'm trying to like <clears throat> figure out. Uh, you've worked with you know other movie studios and stuff like that, and uh, Sean, you've worked with movie studio. What was it like actually collaborating with a comic book and video book? I mean, that's, that's mm. kind of a first for you guys. So. Um, yeah. I've loved it, to, to, to be honest. Um, uh, as I said, uh, w with Ben, I think uh, it was a bit more challenging from, from Ben's side because I pretty much just handballed everything everything uh, <laughs> uh, uh, over over to Ben going, oh, oh, this is a great idea. And Ben's like, but that, that doesn't work. And I'm like, yeah. So, um, no, uh, from, from my side, it, it's been great. Um, Alfie's been really easy to deal with um and that can be an issue sometimes when you are and been uh, touched on this before when you're dealing with other people's uh, ip um they're, they're quite protective and, and everything like that so sometimes that can be be difficult but um alfie has been been great um jason his law master has, has been quite helpful in, in regards to to setting scenes and everything like that and and then ben's uh, been able to have um a bit of fun himself in in uh doing what he does best uh, uh, as well, so yeah, I definitely has say, been. Yeah. Sorry, you go, Alfie. Can you go? All right, I'll go. Uh, I will say the um, the the long game we have here for the mini series it does tie in directly to the um, the ongoing story in the XCT comic. So uh, it isn't sort of like you know how you get those side crossover things that don't really matter much, and you can just sort of skip them. Uh, this mini series will tie directly in and have actually huge ramifications of what happens in the ongoing series as well really so, so this is yeah canon then for yep. the yep. Yep. yep absolutely wow cool that is way Sorry. cool all right so i've got that video prepped um that coil here was just talking about i'm going to go ahead and play that right now Join Spartacus in his most epic adventure yet, traveling through an interdimensional portal, the Paragon of the Extreme Champion Tournament collides with the Infinity Multiverse in a limited series where you get to vote and influence the story. G'day guys, Sean Keenan here, creator of the Extreme Champion Tournament. We are here on Kickstarter again to fund XCT Infinity, the industry's first ever Australian crossover between the acclaimed comic series XCT and video game multiverse, Infinity Wars. Hi, I'm Alfie Coyle, founder and creative director of Lightness Studios. The Infinity Multiverse is one with a rich history, experienced in video game form through Infinity Wars and Infinity Heroes by almost a million players over the last eight years, and has some truly amazing and unique characters and factions. Death Witch Cults, Zen Monks, Bloodthirsty Knights on Motorcycles, Cyborg Zombies, even Genocidal Tech Angels. It's a place where truly anything could happen. 
When the idea of Spartacus being pulled from his universe into a wormhole and thrown into these new worlds became plausible, as either an actuality or perhaps just a really wild dream of his after a drunken night, we knew it was just something we just needed to create. So what can you get as rewards? Well, this is a crossover with a video game company, so we have everything from your standard digital and physical versions of the comic to the video game Infinity Heroes, the Hero Unlock deck packs. To top it all off, we've even got a Become Your Hero or Villain in the comic and game itself. I know, cool right? So what are you waiting for? Back now. Thanks for taking the time to check out this video and our amazing new series, XCT Infinity. Now, we hope that uh, if you pledge uh, and your support, that's greatly appreciated. But if you can share this around on social media, tell your friends, scream it from the rooftop, that will go a long way in us reaching our goal. Till next time, this is Sean Keenan. That was so cool. That was epic. <laughs> so now we're hoping, hoping when people see that, that uh, that it entices them, it tells them enough about the, the story and, and the crossover to, to be uh, wanting to, to pledge and, and help us uh, get across the line. Um, you know, as we said, you know, with indie supporters, every dollar helps. So uh, the, the $5, $9, um, $950 pledge, whatever people can and kind of um, afford is always appreciated. So, yeah. That, that is, is cool. Excellent. So let's do this. My heart says, let's do a t-shirt giveaway. What do you guys say? Ooh, I think yeah. that's a great idea. So. Because we need to get people or, to pledge. Mm-hmm. So let's do this. First person... Mm, what do we do? First person that we can prove shares it out, or the, or the next person that pledges? Do you guys have a ability to see pledges in real time? Yes, I do. Yep. Okay. Let's do next pledge. Next pledge that goes through on Kickstarter, and this is the correct oh, you know Kickstarter you link. Do? Paul, you should show the you should show the shirt. Yep, we're going to show it right it's now. In creation, it's not done yet because some <laughs> people are so slow when you're trying to get something from them. You know what I'm saying? I, I ain't going to say no names. I feel like that's an no attack. Names. So, yeah, so this right here is going to be the shirt so that everybody can see. Ooh. Oh, a little, little blurry cool. when I zoom in, but. Uh, Isn't that cool? <laughs> I haven't seen that yet. That's awesome. Isn't that cool? Let me do this. I'm going to pull up the Photoshop doc. That'll be Ooh, easier. Ooh, he's yeah. going high res. A lot better to see it this way. Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. I so you guys can things. actually see. <laughs> right? So, we've of course got Spartacus in there. I mean, it's brutal to beat down. This is one of the cooler shirts that we've done, and you I cannot wait to have it missing? myself. You know what the shirt is missing? It's not on me. You know what the shirt is missing? <laughs> Ooh, I like that answer. I like that answer. But you know what is missing? An infinity logo. Mm. I mean, if the shirt's not made, we could. It depends on if you if we if you're happy to do it, Sean. We could lend them the cover art um, of uh, XCC Infinity. I'll, I'll tell you what. I'm pretty fast at these, so if you can send me the cover art, I'll make the shirt while we're on the stream. We'll do wait that for minute, the next wait giveaway. Minute, wait a minute. We have to have a negotiation here, Fry. Don't be so quick. <laughs> Jiminy Christmas, man. Rick, you just give away the farm if it's oh. up to you. Just let everybody know. Oh, so I think someone's... Just hit 38 backers. Somebody already did yeah. yeah. it. Let, let me have a look at who it was. It was backer number 38, Matt Russell. Oh! <laughs> what? <laughs> the the legend! Oh! That doesn't count. <laughs> The man, the man, the man. Oh, yeah, because he wants that shirt. <laughs> I better get uh, one of those. That is not cool. All right. The next backer that is not a part of my staff gets a shirt. Okay, okay, but wait a minute. While we're negotiating, while we're negotiating. So I was going through, I was going through the, um, the, uh, uh, the game, and there was this cool button that said comics on it. And I and I clicked on it and actually took you to the thing. I guess this is more mm. of a question for Sean, but you know what would be really cool right there? 
is your uh, profile link for Crypto Comics Marketplace. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just uh, saying. That, that is not my site. That is Alfie's uh, uh, site. He's been kind enough to set uh, set that up on on his site and, and link everything so to, awesome. to the Kickstarter and everything. So <laughs> I, I think that, and what you were saying before, Matt, how it is, um, you know, working with with someone else. Uh, the the biggest thing that I've found is that um, you know we've got someone else with a, a completely different set of skill sets to what I've got. So mm -hmm. um, that that video is far more professional than any of my other Kickstarter uh, videos, and that's thanks to Alfie great video. and Jason. Um, you know, it it does everything that you want a, a Kickstarter video to do. It wants to tell you about the product, it wants to entreat you enough to to pledge and and be passionate enough with the creators that you can actually connect with them so you know um that's the the other thing that i've really gotten out of this is that um what i can do um if if you know i'll put uh put my time and effort into it and as surrounded by by the right people so um yeah i have to have to say it's been a, a pleasure yeah, and likewise. just to let everybody know about this little uh, t-shirt giveaway, there is an option on Kickstarter for you to back without a reward. You can throw a dollar on it and you're considered a backer. Correct. Which means yep. even if you do that, you win a shirt. Really? Yeah. So if yep. I, wait, I mean, so if I'm just asking for a friend. So if <laughs> I went on and backed it for a dollar, then my friend would technically be a backer. That's true. <laughs> That would be true. Uh, Dom Dominic's in chat. He's going, I can't find my bank card. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can just Dominic imagine him at home guys flicking through it. <laughs> Rose, Rose Kirby on YouTube says, was you going to do a t-shirt giveaway tonight or today? We're doing one right now, Rose. Rose, yeah. Rose you got it. You got to get on. Rose, <laughs> remember, Rose is in the UK. Um, if I remember right, Rose is in the UK and has um, some visual elements going on there. So she kind of listens to us as a podcast rather than watching the screen. Oh, right. On. Um, so, yeah, Rose, uh, their link for Kickstarter is actually, if you go to Kickstarter and you search for XCT Infinity Issue 1, I should pull it up for you. Mm hmm. And I was going to say, I'm going to put Alfie on the spot here, but I reckon he should do the, the voiceover for the comic in the crypto marketplace. Oh, dude, I like that. I, I would love to do that. I would actually love to do that. Let's do that. That'd be fun. Excellent. There you go. John. There you go. Yep. So, yeah. so if we can get this made, guys, uh, we'll just <laughs> chuck it in there and... So did, 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 has uh, so has Sean told you about that feature in the marketplace or what? I've just saw it briefly, but please tell me about it now. Yeah. Uh, well, it's it's just it's it's an audio feature that that got set up for um, a different creator way 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 back in the beginning. As as you know, we're in beta too. Um, but so Sean can actually like do a hashtag soundtrack. beta brothers. <laughs> beta brothers, <laughs> I love that. Right? I love that. But um, basically, you can do um, a narration. There's there's a few books in the system already. Uh, Snell the Snail is one, and um, Frantic Froggy is another. But you can actually narrate the book, and it and it the uh, uh, it goes with the turning of the pages and everything. Wow. Like it, it's really, asking, really 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 nice. That would see. be Let's so cool. cool, Sean. Yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. You have that sure. commanding voice. I, I can hear it. I just you know mm -hmm. I see it and I'm like, ooh, he's like <laughs> Superman or something. I oh, know, that's cool. what I said. I said, I looked at all these videos because even yeah, Ben, you know, he's quite good at, because uh, you know, he's done a lot of um, announcing for the wrestling and everything. I look at all these guys and then it's me. And I'm like, you know, the biggest, you know, ocker, uh, you know, crocodile <laughs> thunder. Get out, mate. You know, back my Kickstarter. Oh, all mate. Of them. <laughs> hey, hey, just so you know, you sound like a bad A, Sean. You Thank sound you. like a bad A, so it works. Thank you. I'll give you that. Be a villain, later. John. <laughs> yeah, be a villain. <laughs> villain, yeah. Elfie will be the hero. No offense, Sean. And then you could be the villain. <laughs> yeah, I can't. I keep stuffing up the timeline. Oh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. Uh, great stuff. <laughs> it's been a while mm. since I heard a good uh, flash joke. So. <laughs> it's because they rarely exist. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Sean's just real good. <laughs> Sean is real good. 
So, but um, but yeah, but no, we're super excited about um about where this this story can go. The the one thing that we haven't touched on that uh, sets this series apart, and we're really excited about, is that it is also a choose your own adventure style. So it has um multiple uh um options at the end of each issue where we will set up a, a survey or a site that you can vote on and then that will actually change the direction on or where the direction of the series will will go between each issue so it really gives our fans a chance to actually interact and be able to affect the actual storyline i think that's the biggest thing that um that I've loved about this and, and Ben's been great in regards to um, you know coming up with ideas of how we can use that fan into interaction um, because you know I'm a big fan of those old Marvel versus DC comics and that um, Algama series and everything. So uh, Alfie and I have bond bonded over over talking about that. And, you know, to set this series apart again, uh, we wanted something quite unique for people that, you know, after they've read it, can still um, interact and uh, that with us and the comic w uh, while the next one's getting made. So nice. Super easy to write as well. Like just the easiest thing in the world not knowing where you're going or what's going to happen and just sitting there waiting it, it's a dream come true and i love it yeah sorry mate <laughs> so over on chat uh dominic asks if uh anyone won the shirt yet and no there's only one way to find out yeah you gotta back it you'll find out real quick <laughs> no no <yet. laughs> so <laughs> You're not supposed to tell them not yet, or then oh, they know. Um, I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> so, so with the uh, with the choose choose the ending type situation, is that going to be um, is that going to be where there's multiple different avenues to go, and people can choose their own destiny type adventure? Yeah, well, it's uh, similar to that. Yeah, so John. Sure. Yeah, so I was going to say rather than um, multiple story lines because ben would kill me if i did that um it'll be it, it's more about you're able to vote for for one one direction or another or there'll be multiple two or three uh and then once we've got that locked in then ben will write it from from that point of view so okay. um as ben said it's great for him in regards to wanting the story to go in one direction and the fans totally go in another so he, he's overly <laughs> uh, over the moon about uh, us deciding to throw that in right at the end so um, so and that really was right at the end of us doing the the comic i was like oh ben this is a good idea i think it was going to reach through the phone <laughs> <laughs> so this is kind of like a you know the death of robin type scenario uh with jason yeah Todd. Is that how you're uh, pursuing it yeah in fact um all the heroes die in this one Wow, thanks guys. Dude, thanks. Man, I told you not to spoil these things. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, guys, the dog dies at the end. Why? <laughs> like at the end of every good movie, everybody dies. Uh, let's see. Right. Rose says, Rose on YouTube says, I can't get onto the page. I got injured 10 hours ago. I will try later when I'm upright. Oh, I'm sorry I, to hear that, Rose. Better, yeah, yeah, definitely sorry yeah, to hear about that, Rose. You feel better. Feel better soon, right? Dang. What happened? Mm. It's right. Rose. She's she's probably like taking down evildoers somewhere probably. in the UK. <laughs> probably. Be what she out does, there, Rose. Be careful. Good stuff. So I've just sent you the uh, PSD there, Frey, if you wanted to, uh, I was on the PSD, the, 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 the steel image, in case you wanted to give an option to the to the, uh, the winner of the t-shirt, um, if you're okay with that, Sean, but yeah, there's a couple, there's a, there's the cover for, uh, for XCT Infinity, if you wanted to have, have it be the actual. Nice, uh, yeah, we're, happening. we're building oh, yeah. her out right now, I, uh, I, I might have jumped on your site and stole your logo, so I got to ask yeah. you for permission for that here in a minute. I'll give you a better logo um, to put in there because we'll, we'll have the one that's at the bottom of the comic. Um, if you want to keep it square, kind of thing, then I can give you a, a better logo for that that won't cover up the boys. Uh, we can um, we can make this work, I think. To be honest yeah. with you. Oh boy, oh boy, you hear that? He says he's gonna make something work. Dun dun dun! Never let Fry say that. 
Yeah, for real, real. For real, real. Not for play, play. Uh oh. So about Gosh, your fingers, game. peeps. I should have kept my mouth shut. About this game, uh, what platform does it actually play on? Is it just PC or? It's cross it to do it play, on cross play, um, PC, Mac, and mobile, so Android and iOS. So you'll be able Good. to, you know, someone will be sitting on their computer late at night, whereas you could be on on the train, going to work, and like, yeah, playing playing on your phone versus them while they're on their PC. Yeah. Mm -hmm. wow. So they're really tight games. They're designed to be like five to eight minutes per game, um, and they're simultaneous turns. So it's actually hard, about 30, 30 to sixty percent faster. Than, uh, than a normal game of Hearthstone or something because you're both playing at the same time and not waiting for the other person as much. Yeah. Yeah, I, I love the gameplay. It's really it's really fun. Yeah, mm -hmm. I said the same thing because I haven't played a lot of those card-based uh, uh, games, especially um, on online. So I was actually surprised that, um, one, how easy it was to pick up, but then two, how challenging it was at the same time. So it was one of those games that, you know, um, uh, I, I just kept on using Spartacus and then I was dying. And I was like, oh, what am I doing wrong? And, and um, you know, making sure I had the other two heroes that kind of complemented uh, Spartacus's uh, fighting type really like you know had me uh had me enjoying the game so i was supposed to be actually working and i was like oh, i'm just going to test it out for 15 minutes and an hour later i was like oh i better get back to work that's so, exactly what happened with jared and i we're both like <laughs> we gotta we gotta figure this game out before we go because neither of us were really into magic or any of the card games and stuff and so we both start playing and then we get on go to jump on the stream and we're like did you play it and he's like no and he's like did you play it and i was like no not really and then both of us like pulled up Steam, and we're like, ah, we both played it for like two and a half hours today. So <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I'm just trying to figure out how to play it, but I was just getting, I was just getting to the point where I was making things happen. Like I under, I understand that everything's got to go into that neutral space at first, and then I could, and then I could feed those out into defensive and attack positions, and then I could throw in the the assist to make everything buff up, and then hopefully yep. like fly over the defense of. The, of of the opposing force and just kick the crap out that hero. I was bad like that. Hmm. <laughs> Pretty sweet. So we play, we just had a pledge. Uh, uh oh. It yeah. comes from uh, Taki. Oh, I'm not gonna pronounce this wrong. Taki Mini Sharado uh, from Brisbane, Australia. So. Oh. What? Really? Which is what? which is very very Wait. cool. So. Um, oh. oh. My, they just asked where their shirt is. Fry, you better get on it, dude. We're, they're not playing around, man. Ooh, not at all. All right. Uh, we, uh, what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to message uh, Crypto Comics. Any platform on social media will work. Uh, just look for our logo. So they're on YouTube. It's YouTube slash or YouTube.com slash Crypto Comics Marketplace. But you're already watching us, so I assume you know that. Um, just shoot us private me private message. Let us know what size of T-shirt you wear and your address. We'll get a shot out to you. Thank you. Thank you for backing yeah. them. We appreciate it, man. That's awesome. Dude, that is so awesome. Hey, man, so so can I share my screen without it going live, Fry, so that I can get the game For sure. Out? Go ahead. Let me try. I'm going to see if you I You got to share your screen from your laptop. My, okay. Oh, are you gonna, you're going to play it in real time? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to try. I'm going to try, guys. I'm going to try. Don't, don't, hold, don't, don't, don't hurt me if this doesn't go well. Okay? <laughs> This is going to be great. Dominic says, I tried after I found my card, but my credit union won't let me use my card for overseas payments. Oh. What we could do, guys, just as an idea, is um, because you won't have access to, to Spartacus. So I could boot up a game of Spartac with Spartacus in it, and we could collectively vote and choose what we want to do with the character. If you wanted to do that, we could do Done. It. Done. Yeah. Yes. I was about awesome. to whoop butt, dude. Uh, but not with Spartacus, and I want to see Spartacus. Yeah, I can't. <laughs> Play Spartacus because they freaking cut my nizzuts off right now. <laughs> well, hey. how about how about you make the call if, you, if you're, so, you're so keen to play, you can make the call on the on the other characters. Oh, how about we players. do both? Yeah, because I just I think got this bad A super combo. <laughs> we won't be able to play against each other because we're different versions of the game. But, yeah. uh, Wait a minute. For those of you who haven't watched the stream before, Jared gets very excited. 
Sorry, <laughs> sorry, guys. Am I? I'm sorry. You, we'll go with we'll go with Elfie's idea. Right. Here we go. He got a new gaming laptop. He's wanting to show it off. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> was, like, wait, wait. But it it, it really All is right. a fun you game. You know, it the action is really quick. I like at first when I was start first starting to play it. I was trying to figure out what was going on and stuff. Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait. I want to be a part of the, the, the selection part. <laughs> yep. Um, <laughs> He's, wait a minute, he says. I want to be a part know, of everything. Take it off of Tomb of Heel and put it on um, Will of... Um, oh, what is Todd it? and Will? There you the, go. the one where it gives them the defense up plus one. Yes, yes, Hard and yep. Will. That was so sick. Yeah. All right, and then heroes. So we got obviously Spartacus, number one. Uh, yeah, who else um, do we want? The uh, we the white lady who gives flying. Yep, Lilaria. There we go. The, the dragon lady. And then the dragon lady back. Of course, of course, the one at the very top on the right. Um, she's pretty awesome too, and she's got some pretty awesome cards. Got some Inca. cool tech cards. That'll yeah, be nice. Uh, bit of difference really there. So we'll have stuff. some. All right, let's see. Here we go. Jared, oh, I've got so a couple cool. of people messaging me saying that uh, that you're 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 pretty cool and and uh, they're enjoying your enthusiasm on the on the live stream. <laughs> <right? laughs> <laughs> well, tell them thank you, Sean. Tell them thank you. All right, so we got and Tony White. He's a watching. bit too expensive at the moment to to play out because he costs eight eight eight. Um, so now, is cool. there anything that causes mm -hmm. your um, your spin points to go up more, or is it just you're given so much each per round? You're generally given an extra one every round, but there are certain characters who will give you extra uh, points, yeah. But not, not the, the ones we're playing with right now. Those are resource points, right? Resource points, yeah. There are there okay. are characters that will do that. So yeah. there, there was a character that got a plus one, plus one for every resource, resource point that was left over at the end of a round. Oh yeah, that sounds okay. pretty cool. Okay. I know that doesn't sound familiar to me. <laughs> oh um, really? Oh my bad. So Spoiler we're alert. gonna go Spartacus again and draw another Spartacus card. So we get some Spartacus going before we switch it up. Um, all right. So here we have a two-cost blue tiger with our two resources. Probably makes the most sense to play. Please stop me if I'm uh, if I'm doing something you don't so, want me to do. So, and so that's the other mm -hmm. thing I wanted to ask. So basically. Sure. Each turn is when you select a hero, and then you can only use that hero that one time, right? Like, you can't switch between heroes in the Not same... Not mid-turn. So right turn. now, okay, we can go Spartacus, okay. Lilaria, or Luca. Did you want to choose a different character, or you want to stick with... What's your choice? Four seconds. Three. Um, Luca. Done. Woof. That was close. Okay. That was, like, the most stressful <laughs> part of this game. <laughs> yeah. All right. Dude, Luca. seriously, man. The countdown. Dude. Ah! <laughs> Plus one, what plus happens one if you any don't unit. make it by the countdown, Elfie? That's right. And we, because of Luca, we've got an upgrade, so she's really good at buffing characters up. And so we've got yeah. Spartacus' Blue Tiger, which is aggressive, right? He can only go to the attack zone. He can't go to the defense zone. Um, oh, and he does, when he dies, give us back three life, which is really helpful because this girl has, or the opponent has, the Flame of Fate rune, which deals damage to us every turn, right? At the end of every round, we're taking the damage. That's why we're already on 18 health. And we've got this hardened will that you chose before, which will give a random friendly unit plus zero plus one. And so we've already buffed the blue tiger from being a three one to a three two now. Three attack, two health. All right. So with our three, um, with our three uh, units we, uh, of resources, we can choose to either bring out the failed clone, two five, or we could upgrade the blue tiger, and maybe even upgrade it a second time with our spare uh, one unit. One. Yeah, unit let's do that. We'll do that. We'll go buff tiger, buff tiger. Off we go. But you Here's can't. Hoping. You can't put the. You can't put the tiger in a defense position, and you need to get something into. <laughs> oh my! This is so great. <laughs> listening to Jared so, explain oh, how to play can, a game, you guys. The cool thing about this game that no other game that I know of actually has in a, in a card game form, and that is you can undo your turn. So we, even though we've oh, committed yeah. these three resources, we can go. Oh, you know what? I changed my mind. And I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna undo everything, and now I can bring out the failed clone if we want instead. I and then he'll that button next. A lot. Yeah, he'll next turn be able to go on defense, and we'll have two characters out. So I mean, we've got two choices here, guys. We need a tiebreaker. What are we gonna do? I, I'm, 
I'm thinking Bring out the come on, Jared. Come on, Jared. I think we need defense. So we got to We got to I would say we need to upgrade. So we need a tiebreaker from one of you two, two, Matt. Or uh, yep. come on, Ben. The clone. The clone. We're gonna vote for the clone. How about uh, Ben? What do you vote for? We might to get everyone to vote. I go the clone as well because uh, well, that, that kills it. So no, no need to pray. Even if you did vote the other way, we're gonna. Get I would have gone with the clone. <laughs> oh, that was definitely overwhelming. <laughs> <clone victory. laughs> All right, press enter. And he's moving his flying unit. You can see he's floating over there. Oh, nasty. All right. So, I think <laughs> no, like what happened so there. great. Yeah. Actually, no, I don't need to because we didn't actually have a, 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 an effect chain. So, um, new hero, who do we want to go with? Um, I'm thinking probably Spartacus. Let's bring out some heavy hitters. Done. Done. What do we got? We got a guard. So, he will be a heavy hitter that we can bring out next time. 3 6, reach and vigilance. Um, so he'll be a heavy hitter. Do we? What do we want to do with the the foul clone? Do we want to put him attack defense? I'm thinking hit that some biscuit. He's only going to take yeah. one if he hits us. Yep. We got any uh, way to make him flying? Oh, we need to have Lilith here. Right. Well, he's pretty weak though. He's only got two health. So how about we put an upgrade on him, and he'll become an eight four instead. Oh. Sweet. Uh, and that's yeah that's about it so what we can do is we can pop out a genesis soldier to give us a bit of defense um we'll end up losing the medical concoction because you lose your leftmost card every turn and then you draw back up to five cards every round you're getting a whole new set of stuff to, to play with um and then we have one point left so of course we want to use spartacus as give a friendly attacking unit plus two plus zero just this turn so all up provided she doesn't kill it we should have quite a. No beat way! Beat. Give Spartacus Whoa. to the defense, dude, so he takes There's out. There's no that. defense. Oh, we got no, no. defense. We don't <laughs> got have defense. Up you wanted to attack. We ain't got no defense. Oh that's right. no! Not, we're open. He's not going for us. We're good. We're good. We okay, got a ten right. six. He's gonna oh, ten four. Sorry, he's gonna blitz that thing. And then, because it's a failed clone, next round it'll flip to a three ten. So now it's a three ten. Um, what else we got? <laughs> what do we want to play as? We might as Lucas, well put that Spartacus. Clone. Someone um, choose. L L L L L L Laria. All right, we're gonna bring her out. So she has a nice bit of a uh, bit of flying that she can give. Those animations are so amazing, you guys. I love them. Isn't that? Is. I, yeah, I love how that is. All right, so we have got a beefy defender, so we can definitely put the failed clone now into the um, defense zone. Just make make nah, us stop losing perfect. health because we're gonna stop bleeding because he keeps hitting us every turn by one health. And we haven't even dinted her yet, which is I funny because last game I think we won like twenty to zero or something, wasn't it? <laughs> I had a game um, like that. I felt yeah, pretty awesome. So, uh, okay, cool, cool. So what we have got enough for is the guard. So we wanted some beefy guys, and guess what? He is vigilance, which means he goes straight out into the defense zone. Which oh, means we actually have two characters. We don't need to defend so heavily anymore. We can actually put the clone into the attack zone if we wanted to, just to do a little bit more damage um and off we go that's the end of that that round i'm thinking actually we're good we should also plan out our next turn so she's going to create some cool flying units we can maybe swap yep. him for her so that we still have her in the hand next turn and we'll ditch one of those because we've got two of them oh so, i see that now okay mm. that's why my card kept disappearing on me here you go so it's, <laughs> yeah. demoralizing us again doing another two damage to her and again, another two damage to us. Oh my! Head. Ouch! Ouch! All right, now we get to finally get some get some payback. Here we go. There we go. We're down to ten L. She's down to seventeen. We might end up having to use this uh, die another day uh, spell, which stops you from dying. Um, who do you want to go, guys? Luca, Spartacus. I'm thinking Luca. Luca, buff time. All right. <laughs> Right, so, holy heck, give friendly units plus five, plus five next turn, not this turn, maybe. Uh, this will bring out a couple of units, so it'll, she'll bring out a 2-2 two -two flying token as well as um, as having her. So she's a, she brings out two characters for the cost of four. It's pretty cool. Um, and then we've got six all up. So what do we want to play? We've got a lot of options this time. Um, <laughs> bring out the Check out what one. Adam Thompson just said. Which one? Right on the screen. Uh, on the share sorry, screen. I can't read it. <laughs> no, I'm it says, Adam Thompson said, I know I'm getting the key for the game as a backer, but the, 
Oh, sorry. Were you reading that, Matt? Go ahead. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, but the stream sale convinced me to buy now so I can learn to uh, learn the game. Ah, wow. So, so that means Adam has already bought the game on Steam then. So he did the hero one. He bought the massive one, the hero one, and now he's gone and purchased the game beforehand so he could learn. So <laughs> thank, thank you so much, Adam. <laughs> so, he's, Adam. so he's technically Adam? bought the game twice then, right? Yeah. Yes. Okay, yeah. well... But he'll get the hero unlocked with, uh, with the, um, uh, the Kickstarter one. So um, uh, with the higher level, there's... Uh, Part of that is 10 hero unlocks. So when this comes out of beta, all of the heroes, you only have access to a certain um, amount and then you'll be able to purchase other ones. So um, Adam will be able to unlock all of all of those with his uh, 10 hero unlocks. So well, let's, uh, make it, well his own. let's make it one better then. Since, mm. since he went out and did that, let's, uh, I'm going to switch the stream real quick, Coil, and then I'll yeah, switch it right back to you. So Adam will also win this. This will be the the very very oh. limited Infinity Hero shirt. So Adam, oh, wow. you you will be. I don't know. We got to make this way limited. So okay, like so only five. Only I get one on the team. Whoa! Well, <laughs> I don't think so, Jared. What, wait, wait, wait. Fry said to make it limited. Yeah, that means you don't get one. I do. Oh, come <laughs> on, man. I'll, I'll bro shampoo you for it. <laughs> bring so, it. Bring it. <laughs> Adam Thompson on Facebook. Make sure you shoot us a message on Facebook. Let us know your shirt size and your shipping address. Okay, Fry. We we'll get that shot out to you real quick. I don't. I don't know if that's a good Are you idea. Ready? Are you ready? Best out of three, Matt. <laughs> there we go. Ready? Wait, no, no. Your your camera's not working. This isn't fair. You'll see what I do first. Here, ready? See this? Okay, I'm gonna do the countdown. Ready, guys? Hey, no, no, no. Three, two, one. So, make sure you message us, uh, Adam, and yeah, wear it to death. Oh, this is where the fun begins. Oh no, it's it's beginning. <laughs> okay. Musical chairs. <laughs> okay, I'm I'm gonna remove everybody's capability to to yeah. add and remove here in a minute. If you guys don't knock it off. Guys, stop playing with our cameras, dude. It's not very nice. Oh, jeez. Gosh, man, it makes me feel bad about something. Adam asked, "Do I wear it to death or do I keep it safe? Wear it to death. Wear it to death. Absolutely. While keeping it safe." Yep, right. and Amy says logistics <laughs> gal is in charge of internal shirts, suckers. Oh, 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 I'm logistics coordinator. Oh, like the rings of that. That's uh, that's Amy Fraser on staff saying that neither of them get a shirt. Basically, is that's what just not, happened. That kind of makes me cry a little on the inside. By a little, Why? I mean a lot. <laughs> uh, and Salvatore on YouTube says, "No, I didn't get the shirt yet, Elfie. How do I get it?" Um, talking about the one that they just won. I did that. Yeah. Okay. That, so yeah, was, uh, he's the, he's the guy that backs. So, mm -hmm. so, yeah. so Menrome, you've got to now. Which which shirt? He won the one with. He won the first one. The first mm -hmm. Yeah. That was so. Show show Menrome what he won real quick, Salvador. <gasps> Behind door number one. There you go. Yeah. So. Oh Let's my gosh, dude. Pull that up on stream. That's like, hey, guys, what? Look at the. Oh, okay, there we oh, go. Wow. Man, like, <laughs> hey, uh, you know, you guys can help me with this stuff. You know that, right? No. Wait, what? Really? <laughs> Are you serious? Oh, that's why you got me this cool computer. It's like herding cats here, guys. Oh my <laughs> that's, that's my job. So he's oh, going to contact that, you dude. guys directly to, to get this. Um, so, Salvador, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, is it uh, he's on youtube watching at the moment so uh message you guys on youtube is that correct yep or on any platform just make sure you let us know who you are and uh your t-shirt size and your shipping address we'll get that yep, shot right that's out what to you, you got Minrome. You this got is the one you got and then yeah, adam was, you as well yeah. so, um adam's so watching us on a, facebook i get one of these right fry and matt i get one of these no what nope wait wait you said the other one that man you guys are jerks I, I legit just did a big order for you 
Oh, you're fine. You're fine. So awesome. You have plenty <laughs> of fun. No, I mean, Hi, the guys. ones, the last ones what? that you got is the ones I'm talking about, Jared. Not whoop, another whoop, order. Roof fry. Whoop, he doesn't get it. Roof fry. <laughs> he doesn't get it. <laughs> Anyhow, um, yeah, so shoot yeah, us a message and we'll make general. sure. Mm hmm. That, the answer to Menrome's question is it's Crypto Comics Marketplace on Facebook. Mm -hmm. And you can message us there, and we will make sure that you get that shirt. Yeah. Thanks for tuning in. I'll put it out on our uh, Discord channels and stuff, so it's good for getting some people coming through. Yeah. Nice. That, is yeah. that is fan yeah. freaking tastic. So we are currently sitting at uh, 2346 so we're $154 away from uh, oh. adding uh, two extra comics to every single uh, pledge. So uh, if you are out there and thinking about uh, backing, jump on and, uh, and back now, um, and we will give another two sets of comics uh, away to every single pledge at the end of the, the show, uh, which is which is pretty uh, pretty phenomenal. So you already get uh, XCT Infinity, three other comics, and then you'll get another two. So there will be five comics and XCT Infinity for as low as nine Australian dollars. Which uh, how, what does that work out to be in uh, US dollars, Ben? Uh, it's about thirty two cents. <laughs> Woo Hell yeah! Let's just get better and better. <laughs> Boom! Bam! Yeah. We're really proud of the US Every dollar. charge is going to be more than that. <laughs> we're we're uh, super excited. Later later today, we're hoping to um, uh, release a deep dive video as well. Uh, uh, ben and uh, Jason, the law guys from both the universes, have done an awesome video uh, explaining the backstory of each series, explaining some of the characters. So uh, if people want to know more about our universes, um, we'll be uploading that to the, the Kickstarter and uh, and that um, at the end of um, uh, today as well, which is which is cool. So. Awesome. Hey, when you put that out, Sean, tag me in it and I'll, so I can share it on our Facebook page. Definitely. Yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. Like, with that, Jason's done a good job of like animating so much of that stuff in that in that video. It's just one you know animated adventure um, with with the with the hilarious antics of Ben as well. By the way, right in. Uh, see, that's what happens when uh, Sean messages me at 10 p.m. at night and says, "Hey man, I need this." Okay. By tomorrow. <laughs> that look on his face is classic. That was perfect. Just like what me? No. Uh, what what people don't realize is Ben is up at five a.m. Uh, Four thirty, Sean. Sorry, 4.30 a.m. Oh. Roasts um, uh, coffee beans. So when oh. I message him at 10 p.m. at night, that's not the most appropriate time I should probably be, be messaging. Hey, <laughs> it's what it takes to participate in this industry. Like right. I tell everybody, if you want to be a part of the comic book industry, you better be prepared to work multiple jobs. And I'm oh, personally yeah, totally. a big fan. I'm, I'm personally a big fan of Ben 10 p.m. So... <laughs> <laughs> Don't know why, he just sort of like sleeps and farts on the couch. It's not really... <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> oh! Hopefully it's not silent, but violent. I know somebody who does that. Oh, no, you oh. know. Foghorn, but... Uh, Foghorn? Oh, Foghorn? <laughs> I know what you'd be talking about. Hey, let's get back to the game! Oh, oh, we have a game. We have a game going. Okay, so uh. here we go. I've just put a couple of plays in here. We just dropped um, Conertian, I can't pronounce the name, and then buffed up the failed clone to make him hopefully a 13-2. And we'll see what happens. We have got initiative, so that means that we're, our spells will go first. Because it is a simultaneous turn gameplay, right? So what happens when both people drop a, drop a spell on somebody? Um, there we go. Ding, ding. I don't know if we... Come on, guys. We've got to bring this home. Because she's a 19 health. 20 health. Jeez, she's going back up. You've got a freaking... Hey, she man, nasty. I'm blaming the controller, dude. Yeah. I'm blaming she's the person nasty. behind the controls, man. You can't You can't blame the voices in your head. Uh, You're making right. us look bad, Alfie. <laughs> <laughs> Who we want? Spartacus, Luga, Lularia. Um, 
Oh, dude, we got we got that big hitter. Did our not did our big hitter not freaking hit? What just happened? He, he, he splattered some girl. Uh, looks like I'm going for Spartacus by default. All right. <laughs> oh. He is our default. But oh, come on, two more points and we can get this songwriter. That'd be oh, nice. Mate. Um. So what? So what is that right there? Those two cards that hold off to the side next to the seven. They're the ultimates. So you have an ultimate unit and an ultimate spell. So you will be able to use one ultimate unit and one ultimate spell per game among the three heroes. Oh, right? okay. Yeah. So what okay. we can do is, I reckon we drop out a failed, no, I reckon we drop out a, yeah, failed clone. And we can do this lion scotum. We need to actually buff ourselves a little bit here. Um, that'll actually give, all friendly units plus zero plus three and immunity to kill effects. So we're going to pr protect ourselves pretty hard, and hopefully that does the trick. Okay, she's coming in. Everyone buffs. Dang, dude, I really like oh. that freaking thing that they have that just does damage to us every round. It's nasty. Yeah, that thing is brilliant. I don't think that was in my game either. It wasn't in your choices, no, no, because it's, it's an AI practice. So you get to choose all of them. So here we go, Spartacus, Lilarius, <laughs> Luca. Who do we want? Um, Luca. Luca. Luca it is. Okay, cannon fire, deal five damage to an attacking unit. Hmm. This one will get plus three attack for each friendly blocking unit. So you know what? We're not going to put any blocking units and let it be a zero six. We might also buff the uh... buff the six five. Yep, good call. Buff the six five. We have five left, so let's drop a splitter robot because if this thing dies, it creates two one one mini bots. Yes. And yes. we can buff again. Who do you want a plus one plus one to be given to? Um, I say the three five or the six five. Someone. The three five or the six five. All right. Three five, well, five. Six, five, three, five, five it is. And end turn. Ooh, we're on four health. We're going to keep ticking away. Oh, yes. That's enough to definitely buff it. We'll speed it up a little bit here. We can actually get a fast forward button. So you can see it. Bang, bang. And then upgrade. Nice. More pain. We're on three health. Ugh. All right. I spot it because we pull out the big gun. Come on. Let's pull out the big gun. Yeah. What's going on Let's here, man? It. Let's do it. Ah. we got nine. There we, we go. Right up. Oh, my God. Now. Oof. So we have to defend have against the 4 8, right? So we have to at least defend against the 4 8, but we'll bring out Sunrider. This is risky, but let's see. Let's play. As long as we don't. No, because we got one oh. more time. Gonna have to put Sunrider on attack and hopefully it. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. What is that? Oh, we're. Oh! oh. Damn, Sonrider got out, but he didn't get to do it. We brought him down to 12 health. Damn. Well, what? GG. And I was just about to pull out a Warcry. That could have won the game. So Warcry would have made every character fight every other character. Um, Spartacus's favorite move. Yes, but, that uh, would have been awesome. Not I today. To I wanted to see that one. We might have to play one more round because... Damn All right. How this game works. <laughs> <work. laughs> you want to do that? I'm I'm turn. I swear to goshness. All right. So how about we we could pair up Spartacus with an agent coil if, if we're if we're feeling like uh playing a little bit fun. So feeling what? frosty. Hmm. Yeah. Do it. Yes. So Man, I I know I've said it already, guys, but these animations are amazing. I'm really digging them. The artwork and everything that's in here. You guys, it's clear that you guys took a lot of time and. An emphasis, yeah, and oh, I love it. Yeah. So this is, uh, yeah. There we go. So, so it's your agent coil. That is what? the agent coil. Let's have a look at that. <laughs> Does Holy look familiar? Lucky son of a biscuit. <laughs> Fancy awesome. that. I made a video game. <laughs> that is so it. awesome. <laughs> yeah. You know what's interesting? I don't know if you've noticed this, um, Sean, but there's so much, there's so much uh, crossover between Spartacus and Agent Coil. I just, I just didn't want to announce it, but we might as well say it because Spartacus, uh, Agent Coil's got a whole bunch of clones working for him. 
And believe it or not, he actually turns into a 1010 dragon with flying at level 10. <laughs> <laughs> I kid oh, you not. Wow. You can't you can't make this stuff up any better, right? Like it's, it's <laughs> the synergies there between the characters. Um, oh, so that's really I cool. I like that life link. Man, I just like to is kind of bad, eh? Yeah. I, I didn't when I was writing the comic. I didn't realize that Agent Coil was maybe based on someone. Uh, so I just want to apologize for what happens to him in the last couple of pages, Alfie. Uh, I, I didn't know. Right. Uh, <laughs> I didn't get any editor's notes from Sean, so uh, let's blame him and certainly not right. me. I'm going that was deliberate, Ben. That was deliberate. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can you get, know get it on the was. Chin, man. It's all right. I've copped enough. <laughs> you know it's just like, oh, don't make me a bad A. See what happens yeah. to your card. That's it. And I've just picked a leader primal caretaker because you mentioned the wanting extra resources. So her ability is to give plus one max resources next turn, oh. which is cool. Um, and to just really show that Australian spirit, we've got a drop bear. Yeah, <laughs> oh, <laughs> we went over that. Spartacus. So this and he is actually, the right uh, here. in the full game, he'll actually transform into um, this nasty little thing. When he gets damaged, he turns into this like psychotic little black, like dark version of itself, uh, evil version of itself. So it goes just like the real one, really nasty. The yeah. real ones in Australia yeah. here uh, do that. It's scary as hell. You, you exactly. Like You're like, oh, right. cute koala. Oh, scary as shit, koala. No, no, they're different species. They, they, you think they're a koala, but they're not. <laughs> oh, serious? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's really scary. Not <laughs> well, quite. What's no, the I'm scary gonna take it out. I'm gonna show a different, call. um, different battlefield if I can. Uh, and by the way, just a little flash up. Here's the XCT Infinity inside the game. It's cool. Um, and I'm just gonna show you guys a different background. Oh, bad. So. Hey, so you get to actually pick the backgrounds. Huh. Alrighty. Agent Here we go. Marvel. So, we round, turn around, round one, we've got Fawn, move a unit to the defense zone. We haven't actually got much we can really play here, so we're just going to go end turn. And I love that we've got the lava battlefield there on the, on the right side. Um, Did you just end turn want? without putting something out? Uh, there was nothing to put out. We had nothing to put out, so there was oh, no, no, no units. We only had abilities. Who do you want to play as? Six seconds? Oh. Agent Coil. Done. All right. So this taunt was the only one cost we had, and you can see by the little oh. slip there that it's actually an ability, not a not a character. Yeah, but we have two I choices here. We have an unstable good. creation, which is two one with deadly. Nice. Or we have the blue tiger, three one aggressive, heal life. What what's that um deadly one? Oh uh, yeah, two one. So deadly will kill a unit, anything that it hits it, anything it hits it kills instantly, even if it's oh. got ten life. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> Put him in defense. All right, we will put him straight into the support turn for now because he has to go into support first turn. All right, she's going to buff him to 2-3, take a bit of damage on the chin there. We're down to 18, but it buffs now to 2-2-2. Two, two, two. Two, two, two. Two, two. Uh, All right, who do you want next? Alita, Spartacus, Spart oh, or AC again? Uh, no, nah, Alita. Let's, uh, Alita it is. Uh, the caretaker. Oh, look at this. Oh, plus one max resources and you gain two life. How cool is that? Oh, you, got your, you got your wish right there, man. Some pretty nice art too. All right, so we'll drop that out. Now we've got that happening. Do we want to put uh, this into the defense zone or the attack zone, guys? Attack. Attack. Let's do some damage. All right, another one of these little things comes out. Buffs them both. We go back up to 20 life, we go back down. But it's 18 plays 18. Well, there we go. Still in the game. Who next? Um, Spartacus, probably. Spartacus it is. All right. With the five resources we now have, we can put out a fail clone. We can do another growth and get more resources. And get get to get to 10 really quickly to put out Sunrider if we want. Um, yeah, do that. Yeah. Let's do that. We'll, we'll push to get Sunrider out this time. We've got some strength behind us already, so that's good. Um, and we still have a two energy left, so I'm going to pop it. Spartacus' ability on there. Now. Perfect. We're going to lose that unit. That's fine. Let's do that. Okay, so these two ones are nasty. We need something to take out all these little annoying fellas because this is going to start to become overwhelming with the amount of characters he has. 
Okay, Spartacus Agent Coil leader, character choice. So Agent Coil, stay put. Done. Uh... Ooh, here we go. So we have seven resources. We've really buffed pretty hell hard versus their five, which is great. So, um, we have a drain, which is useful. Give an enemy unit minus one, minus one, and a random friendly unit plus one, plus one. Now, so now try... if that, yep. if that, will that... Uh, minus one, minus one actually kill that one that's a two one? Sure will, unless it buffs between now and then, but we'll see. Oh, okay. We'll pop it on. Because he has got initiative, so his, his ability should go off first. So, um, with five left, maybe we drop. Ooh, we could drop Spore, uh, my fierce companion. He's my little. Uh, yeah, that thing is. Um, yeah. Shadow Wolf. There we go. He's got a, um, a symbiote inside him, actually. Symbiote Wolf. <laughs> All right, that's awesome. And attack. We'll go full out and attack, hey? Let's do that. Let's see if we can get some damage into him. All righty. Oh, he's put one into the defense, two into the defense. But luckily, our drain will go off, kill it, buff up spawn. We'll take I one damage to the chin, and it buff buffs back. him. Those those are nasty because they've got life link, right? So they're, they're giving him health every time. But uh, we'll see if we can do enough damage to him that he can't get his health back. We. We hit him pretty good that time. Oh, we and did. we that buff our. All right, buff next our unit, next hero choice. Um, I say Spartacus. I still want to see that. Uh... Yeah, Spartacus. Well, you know what? We've got next turn. We'll have Sunrider, so we'll fix up Spartacus again. And this turn, we actually rolled into Tanawa, which is an eight cost, eight eight. Ooh. Whenever this attacks, move a random enemy unit into the defense zone. Oh, nice. Let's bring him out for eight. Uh, cool. I think that's about it. Obviously, with eight, we're spent up. Maybe we'll put the deadly unit into the defense zone. Yes. So if this thing keeps attacking, it's gonna die instantly. Let's see. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Oh, yep. Oh, he swapped it. Ooh, ouch. That hurts. So he's gonna do one damage to everybody, including his guys, which was good because it killed off that that guy. Okay, buffing up Tanewa. All right, now let's get Sonrider out, hey? Let's do that. Nine, nine cost, ten, ten, flying. Mm. At the end of every turn, deal one damage to all enemy combat units and give plus one, plus oh to all friendly combat units. So we're going to take the buff over here onto Taniwa from, from Sonrider and just press end turn. Now... Oh, so now did, didn't oh, you need to put Sunrider in the first position to get the to get the uh, defense no. buff at the end of the turn? Nope, he just uh, he just automatically does it from wherever he stands. But it backfired a little bit because it pushed the uh, <laughs> the, tw the two twenty into the uh, defense zone. Um, oh, that's a nasty one. What do we want to do? A leader, it is. We need to get more. Oh. All units in your hand cost zero. It's pretty handy. Shall we do that? Oh, that's yeah. dirty. Yeah. <laughs> oh, units. yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. Um, I'm going to buff ourselves up a bit. And we'll leave this. I was going to spend this, but we want to leave it so that next turn it rotates out and these three become zero. So I, oh, okay. I don't even know if he's going to get a chance. Oh, he will. Ooh. It's not quite enough to kill it, huh? Oh, wait. Oh, end of the turn. All right, we'll see what happens. And we're going to force it, because <laughs> of Tandy we're going to force that into the defense zone. We're going to have our, all our units become zero, cost zero, which is great. And don't tell me that's going to happen. Yes, it is. Ouch. No. Oh, oh, yeah, we found our first bug. <laughs> it's like, you no, know what? No, you don't get to play. You don't get to win. We just had a game crash, gentlemen. My apologies. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's why it's in beta. Have you seen my name? It's because I'm on this stream. That's why it crashed, because I'm the bug magnet. Oh, uh, the bug magnet. You just drew one into you. That was your yeah. special <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> your ulti that. ability. Your ulti is to is to, is to yeah. the game out. It really is, man. It, the glitch and, yeah. Yeah, Wreck-It Ralph, awesome. I'm, I'm, the, I'm the glitch. 
the glitch master. <laughs> so, so this is what this is what we're saying about uh, the crossover. It's it's a great game that everyone can can play, but then the the comic itself just expands on on the the gameplay in regards to immensing you into the the universe, and then um, you know it's kind of uh, exciting to, to see where this uh, where this will go. So mm. um, yeah, and these comics yeah. are so good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, absolutely. That was one of the things I was stunned by, like walking through the the the, uh, the festival when we first met. It was just like that. That was the, the art is just incredible, and um, just to see Ben, your writing, the way you've been able to take you know what's happening here and actually integrate it in a way that works with 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 Jason. Very very happy with that. Thanks. Oh yeah, we got a, got a click through here on the crypto side. Is this on the crypto yeah. side? Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah. sir. Yeah. yeah. You're just mentioning the art, so I figured I should probably show it since I was kind of, mm. you know, reading the comic at the same time. Oh, my heck, Fry! Hey, I can do this. I'm testing. Yeah. So this oh, one that you've right. got up there is our um, San Diego Comic Con exclusive, so you can only get this digitally from your from your site, so you can't actually get this uh, anywhere anywhere else. And Ben actually went back and um, made what I wrote a um, hundred times better, so uh, that's, that's been re-edited um, and everything like that. So, uh, well, but yeah, well, you can only get that um, digitally from your from your site, uh, and we had given. Even, uh, or, or people have gotten it through the Kickstarter, uh, but we actually don't sell that anywhere anywhere else. So that's a, a crypto exclusive. That one. So yeah. So I just, hey, third party crypto exclusive. Yeah. Hey, Elfie and Ben, you guys should should use this link that's going across the bottom, and actually join up into the marketplace and check out these these uh, these comics in the reader. Uh, Absolutely, man. I'm keen John's to do it. John's comics are fantastic. I mean, just so incredible mm. and i love how well you guys actually put the art into the game you guys did such a phenomenal job really mm. yeah i like i like how you yeah. stuck with the uh with the um the cartoon look comic style Instead yeah of taking it more like your characters you kept it yeah that was a question it was like where do we go with this because i mean obviously yeah we we have got consistent art styles across some of our games and stuff and and our factions but with infinity heroes it really is designed to be all heroes from the omniverse right and that's the reason why any player can actually go into the game and change every piece of art in the game for something else of their choice right and then play with whatever whatever hero they want um as long as it lines up with those characters abilities at this point so that's so cool yeah, so yeah. Neat. and then we used um as i said before david jackson who did the artwork he's not the the guy that works on the original series and the the reason we did that was we actually wanted something a little bit different. So we didn't want the same artwork that you see in the series and we didn't want to be exactly like the artwork that was in the game. And we thought that, um, you know, this would maybe entice people if the, the artwork and everything was a little bit different. So, um, you know, David did a great job in doing that keeping that comic feel but designing it up to look cool as a as a card um and then alfie's team did uh, an, an even better job in regards to um you know animating it and what it looks like afterwards i couldn't believe it when i got the the, the animations back i was like how cool does this look so yeah yeah it's yeah. so cool and speaking of the game, I'm happy to uh, give a code of give a code away. Actually, oh. what? What? So you, you can help us beta test it right now with that crash. But um, no, I assure you that was uh, that was an anomaly. That was, well, uh, well, we got we got to put it behind. Do we want to right here? <laughs> do we want to put it behind <laughs> something? Throwing one on you because we yeah. were about to win. Yes, yeah. that's right. It was getting a bit jelly. Do we um, want to do we want to throw this behind something, or do you want to just throw it in the chat and let whoever redeems it first gets it? Ooh, oh, that's an interesting way of playing it. I mean, that that seems like that. the extreme champion tournament to me, that, mate. I think yeah, that's that's awesome. Awesome. <laughs> Adam on Facebook says David Jackson's also the artist for Junkyard. Yes, ah. yes. So, oh, so I wonder, I wonder with uh, where whether Adam will actually uh, get um, uh, David to do his character in the in the video game because that'd be cool as well. So. Ooh. Just there you go, Adam. Just a little suggestion. Pair them up with an animator to get the animation. And what we can do is actually connect the two guys and have them talk prior, um, and then we'll see what they can do when they work together, if that works. I mean, obviously, you've got to dun, the dun, dun. 
but yeah, let's uh, let's do something like that because then they can actually plan out the card a bit more and, and actually yeah. um, do some cool stuff with the animation as well if they're working together from the start. So yeah, cool. Uh, do that. So anyway, the code is coming up. So here's my question. So with the code that I got, am I going to get like Adam's character and all these other things added to the code someday or, or is it like... Yeah, well, look, while we're in beta, and this, we are in closed beta, so currently it is a purchase beta. And then down the line, a few months down the line, we, um, not, not years, it'll be months down the line, we'll go to open beta where it will become free for everyone to play the game. But then at that point, people will have to unlock characters by either buying tokens or earning them in the game. Um, oh, cool. So you'll only have like a handful of characters to start off with and then there'll be the rest of the 40, 50 characters that you have to unlock through the game. But right now, while we're playing the... Um, while we're doing the closed beta, if you get in on the closed beta, you get unlimited access to all the heroes in the closed beta. So we can oh, test it, right? So um, cool. And also so you can enjoy it because you paid to get into the into the beta. So you deserve that. Yeah. So, yeah, so cool. like yours, I just, I just want to reiterate, I just want to reiterate for everybody out there. If you get in now, you get to access all the awesome characters. Yeah. This yeah. is was, so going to be my new awesome. addiction. Dude, right? so, so with awesome, yours, Fry, with the um, one that you've got, you get three hero code unlocks. So when it does go to that open beta, you will Suckers. get three unlocks straight away um, that you won't need to, to, to pay for. So that's the, the cool thing and the, the part that we're trying to entice people to back now and, and help us uh, get this made. So that, uh, you know, when it does get to that open beta, that you already have these, you know, if you've got your favorite characters that you're already playing with, you can unlock them uh, straight away and um you know elf is always looking at expanding and and um adding uh new things to the game so it's going to going to be pretty exciting so okay yeah. so and just to make sure i have this correct this code that i'm about to put into chat is only good for one-time usage correct yep so the first person that redeems this code gets the beta Everyone else is too slow. Matt, put your hands up like this, Matt. (laughs) 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 All right. So get ready, chat. Three, two, one. Go. So the first person to get that, if you can also, if it redeems for you, if you can please put a message in the chat just so that we don't piss off Steam by trying to redeem the same code over and over again. (laughs) Yeah, we don't. Am I allowed to go redeem this code? No. Jared, no. Jared, Jared, you you already got a. I was asking for a friend. I don't know why you guys get so serious all the time. Oh my. I'm going to. I'm going to pull Amy onto this stream here, <laughs> just so that she can sit. Right. There's no, there's no, what? I was joking. Wow, I haven't seen Jared back up like that. I need to meet this Amy. Dude, she's a logistics coordinator, dude. You don't mess with the logistics coordinator, all right? Yeah. Well, you know what? There's a couple of comments I'm going to say here. So one is that uh, if we want to see uh, Spartacus in the game, we will be seeing him. All going well, we'll see him before the end of the Kickstarter. So we'll be launching him into the game for anyone who's in the game. We'll be able to start playing him before the end of the Kickstarter because the bug testing's gone pretty well. But just in case it was actually Spartacus being cheeky and, and uh, causing that bug that the game crashed, we do have it in a, like a separate um, like in a sandbox. A special separate server. Uh, where people get to play it who are like on the inner circle. And I'm telling you, man, you up, up here, Mr. Bug Magnet, um, with a name like that, I can't not, uh, and, and, and such an amazing experience you've provided for us today in, in doing the, kick, the Kickstarter launch for America. I'm going to give Thank you, you access, give you exclusive access to the council server. So you'll actually get access. To oh, the that's the worst server. idea you've ever and had. You'll be able to play as Spartacus <laughs> right now. So I'm telling you, you are going to regret that so much. <laughs> it's about <laughs> to go down. We don't even let him on the Crypto Comics sandbox. Yeah. <laughs> we just yeah, share video. Um, Jared, I'm just on facebook.com forward slash Elfie. Um, just hit me up on Facebook, and we'll I'll send you the uh, the access to that. Well, cool. So everyone in chat, if your name happens to be Jared, hurry up. <laughs> send <him a> <laughs> save save Coil the trouble because <laughs> this is gonna get bad. A screenshot of Jared right now. And change your profile picture. <laughs> Has Matt frozen his screen again? Is he is he jumping on getting the code? 
Just yeah, like, Matt Matt purposely froze his screen so that he can redeem the beta, I'll bet. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, too. I was like, is it just me? He's like, look, everybody, I'm perfectly fine. He's been really quiet for a while. Like, he's Holy totally shit. bad at grabbing that code. He's like, those sons of biscuits don't give me anything. It's probably a card. He probably has a cardboard cutout just ready to go. <laughs> he just flipped up. <laughs> I'm actually going to have to do that now. What? <laughs> okay, alright, we're just making sure we're there, man. Yeah, you so can hold that post. Oh, yet? there he is! Oh, did you see him take the Funny. down? I saw that. Nice. Oh, man. Alright, we'll find out if they, if they end up uh, mentioning that they've got it, then they can pop that into the chat. Mm -hmm. um, yeah! What else? Well, that's anything awesome, else guys. Thank you. Sean, sure, anything else we want to mention, Ben? Well, guys, you got any questions at all? Any other questions for us? Hmm. Let's do, real quick, one last breakdown of the different tiers on the Kickstarter for you guys. Yes. Because um, like I said before, there are so many options on here that it can it can feel a little bit overwhelming for someone. Um, but once you figure out exactly how this is all broke down, it's, it's crystal clear. You know what I mean? Um, I actually, you know what? I'm going to let you guys do it because you guys are going to do a much better job hey, dude, at it than I am. Dude, you like on a magazine or something, Elfie? <laughs> yes, I'm on a magazine. I'm on a. What? It was it was a free magazine, but I'm on a magazine. It was called Feature yeah, Magazine. We did like a. They actually, put, they actually put. They actually put. I wanted to put. I wanted to put the agent coil on the front cover, but they wouldn't do that. They put a picture, a normal picture of me on the front cover, and then they did a beautiful two-page spread, which has like what? agent coil in it, and then a whole breakdown of. Um, of, of like my role in the games industry. So we've got a, a game studio that's been around for 12 years, and we actually give. Thousands. We've given thousands of high school students in Queensland and Victoria the opportunity to work for us and get paid to learn how to make games. So, yeah. And we can Very cool. Give them a yeah, round of applause. Like... That is fantastic. That, oh, is, yeah. that is really fantastic. <laughs> yeah, cheers. Yeah. That actually, um, Matt, Matt actually uh, works with kids, um, teaches, them, teaches them programming and stuff like that in high school. Oh, so that, wow. that's awesome. That's great. Cool, man. Um, Rose on YouTube. Kind of corrupt kids. Oh, they're corrupt. I've worked in that classroom with them. <laughs> well, yeah, dude, I'm not gonna joke, man. They're freaking ruthless. So Rose on YouTube says, "Is anyone you send a message on Instagram? Can't sleep because you cop cars." Got it's like, um, yes, Rose. I just sent you a message back, just letting you know that I had gotten your message for your shirt win from Boom. the last stream. Rose, so, so sweet. Let's see here. So the breakdown of the different tiers. Uh, you've got, of course. You know, pledge just because you believe in the product um, or project, I should say, uh, which can be anything. I think from a dollar is that right? A dollar on up, and it's just hey, essentially. I don't, it. I don't see it, Fry. I can't think. What's going on here? Yeah. What, what's all right, all right. We'll show the screen. Yeah, I was like, I was really worried, man. I was like, yeah. oh, my screen's not working. Now, so I, the easiest way to break break this down is at the five dollar the the. Um, one dollar or nothing tier gets you nothing. You just back the project because you wanna okay. wanna help us out. Cool. Uh, the five dollar tier, you get the digital comic, mm. and then that's it. And then every other tier moving forward, it kind of gets you get more and more for the dollar that you pledge. So at nine dollars, uh, you get the XCT Infinity plus three other um, comic books uh, with about 150 pages worth of artwork. Uh, as I mentioned, if we can get up to 2,500 on this show, uh, we'll add another two comics to that nine nine dollar pledge. Oh, come on, guys. Come on, guys! From there, uh, we've got the, the first physical edition, which is $15. Now, you can choose between the two covers. So there's a cover A and a cover B. Um, so you get to choose which one you want. So you can uh, we'll do that via a survey at the end. If you can't choose, then we do both the covers for $25. And then you get the PDF pack and everything that's included with that. So uh, over 150 pages of artwork and everything. Then from the $30 um, price point down, we just add, add, give you more and more value. So $30, you get the game. Uh, the PDF uh, um, comic, you get the Spartacus Hero Unlock, and then you get the Spartacus deck that comes comes along with that. Uh, at 40, you get the, the physical comic, the digital comic, the game, 
the hero unlock and also the um, XCT deck. At $50, it's a purely digital um, reward, but it gives you the whole XCT back catalog, which is over um, 360 pages of full colored Huge. artwork. Um, it gives you the um, Infinity Heroes game. It gives you the Spartacus unlock as well as the, the deck. So all for $50, uh, as well as that PDF reward pack that we'll continually add on to. Uh, the next one is the, the one that you've got, Fry, which is uh, the physical extreme. So that's all of the physical uh, back issues of, of the comics. So that's three graphic novels, five single issues, as well as the XCT uh, Infinity comic. Uh, you get access to the game, you get the Spartacus hero unlock, and then you get to unlock three other heroes. So when it goes to the, the open beta, you'll be able to have the Spartacus one and three other hero unlocks as well. Uh, at 150, we've got to uh, get yourself drawn in as a background character in the next issue. Mm -hmm. um, so, which is kind of uh, the the comic one that we always kind of uh, give out. So, I've got um, a friend Moira who's decided to to take one of these these up. Um, she's been a big fan of the series, so to be able to have her in the background is kind of a, a cool idea. Uh, that gives you access, and you can actually scroll down, right, mm -hmm. as well to shut off. A little bit if you want. You scroll, no, the other there one, the, uh, the, the, the with the variant, the big screen. No, no, sorry. The uh, you can actually scroll the main screen down in the middle. Well. Oh, yeah. my bad. I, <laughs> this thing's broken up so much. I, oh my heck! The whole time you've been doing that. Side well, it's part. it's a little hard to read on the red on white with yeah, the a with the stream. So. Yeah, and then and then the the other um, the hundred and seventy five dollar one is just the variant covers. So with XCT, we always do a standard and a variant cover. Um, so with that one, they're limited to only uh, three hundred copies of each, uh, three to five hundred copies of each cover. So they're extremely um, harder to to get. So they're at the hundred and seventy five dollar mark, as well as you get the PDF of the Infinity. Wars um, art book, which is uh, how many pages was that, Elfie, as well? That's a 120 page full color art full book. Full yeah. art book. Yeah, if you like cool. it, uh, art, it's got it all nice. Yeah, A4 pages for some of those artworks as well. Um, and then, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then. Then the final two, which is which is really exciting, is we've got um, uh, I got to go to San Diego Comic Con last year. We did the first ever Australian um, San Diego go comic con exclusive um so that's the one that's up in crypto marketplaces but we've actually got two signature series cgc graded uh issues we're, we're offering so uh there is only six of these in the, uh, the whole world so it's signed by both myself and uh by jerry the artist uh these comics were only limited to 200 um in san diego comic con and there was only six that were graded as uh cgc um so they are um that package is 450 dollars but on top of that when we we're trying to come up with these rewards alfie was able to come up and find some of the um hard copy infinity wars uh books from 2014 now they are signed by the whole cast um in that book as well and there was only i think 10 of those um available so we've only got two of those rewards available but then it gives you all the 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 back issues of xct both covers of xct infinity it gives you the access to the game as well as 10 hero unlocks as well so when it, it, goes it also it, says here that it's a signed art of infinity war book yes Correct. so, so that's signed as well and signed by all i think five of the members including myself back in i think it was even 2012 um we had that so and it's uh, vintage almost <laughs> and it's a 9.4 slab from cgc 9.4 yeah. yep now yeah. now correct uh, me if i'm wrong fry but that's really damn good right uh it's, that's uh that's pretty good hold on let me have my screen <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I just need to change some things here. <laughs> oh my, were you well, I missed it. There was a slab in this thing. I was trying to hurry. Oh my right. heck, man. Are you serious? Um, while you're looking that up, it's, it's worth mentioning as well that we've actually had 
those put me in the comic. There's only one of those left now, so there's two two out of the three are gone already. And then wow. for the top for that for those two, the the two San Diego Comic Cons and the and the slab, they're both available. Uh, correction, there's one. Oh. And you guys oh. just beat your goal. Oh, oh. thank you very much. Live on the screen. I I hit refresh about five minutes ago, so that happened pretty quick. I actually hit refresh to, to get those. Stats. I was I was already a backer, so all I had to do is change it. Yeah. <laughs> oh my heck, that was you, uh, guy. Yeah, oh yeah. Right. I need I need that CGC slab. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, yeah. yeah I hear you. So hear yeah, um let me let me pause everybody real quick. I'm sorry here. Uh Rose Ash on YouTube. Um oops, sorry, wrong message. Uh hope everyone has a great Batman Day. Can you pay with pounds? Um it looks yeah. like Lightmare Studios has already answered that, but just let everybody know yes you can. Kickstarter will convert it to your local currency. And I will add one thing now that I've bought the one that I really want. They are shipping worldwide, it says. So Oh, these guys are not playing around, people. Let's get yes. in and let's back them. Yes, yeah, so we ship, right? we awesome, ship uh, world, yeah. worldwide, and mm -hmm. um, you know we make sure that um, uh, it's packaged all nice and good, and and we try and You're do better, it all Sean. reasonably priced as well. So I was gonna um, be giving you a, a wag of the finger if it don't come all pretty with a bow and stuff. Uh, I'll even write him a personalized note. I think. Oh, uh, just to oh, thank you very cool. much. So, I might you're even throw cool. a few extras in there for you as well, mate. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's why we like our boy Sean. He takes care. So, of thank us. you to um, Fry fr and um, uh, to Matt who have um, generously backed the Kickstarter. Yeah, well, yeah, Jared. Three, the three uh, amazing hosts. Uh, two of you guys are, are fantastic, and one's uh, just a little bit dodgy. But anyway. Uh... Gosh, you guys are freaking mean. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Sorry. Mm -hmm. but, uh, I got to go. Ask, now, now I'm going to have to go ask my wife. And there is, there is still the villain Kickstarter available. I just yeah, want to let everybody know about that. I kind of yeah. cut these guys off before they had a chance to talk about that, and we talked about it a little bit earlier on the stream, but you get basically everything, and everything. You, you become a villain, if I'm if I'm not mistaken, in both the game as well in a future XCT comic. Correct, yes. Which is too rad and makes me kind of wish that I wasn't a single dad because I'll, oh. I'll trade you a teenage kid for that one. <laughs> Is that will that work? Not a bad I idea. I've already got one. Oh. I don't need that one. <laughs> you know who's getting the better end of the deal, then, don't you? <laughs> uh, Rose Kirby on YouTube says, "Please, can you say on air when the Kickstarter ends?" Lightmare Studios seems to have answered that already. October seventeenth or eighteenth, depending on the time zone. Dude, I want to just tell Lightmare Studios, right. "Nicely done." Yeah, very, good. very good. Those guys, are, yeah. those guys are killing it, Agent Coil. Uh -huh. <laughs> so the Kickstarter runs for 30 days, um, but uh, as we mentioned before, in regards to, to keeping us up in algorithms and getting more people to, to see it, um, if you're able to share it around, that would be absolutely fantastic. Let people know know about the project. Uh, but if you do back early, that does also keep us uh, keep us up there um, at the at the top. So it was kind of cool to wake up this morning that we're on top of Berserker, on top of uh, Keanu Reeves. Yeah, oh, wow. made, made me Amazing. feel uh, feel good. So I'm gonna post no up way. about that. I took a screenshot of of that, and I was like, <laughs> "You, Keanu Reeves, that is awesome." <laughs> <laughs> How about that? Bet you are a better rider than Keanu Reeves. Dude, we can't go nothing on Spartacus. Yeah. That thing, well, yeah, I'm. That's, I'm really, that's excellent adventure, and you're on top, dude, of Berserker. That's incredible. How, now, how does that work? So, so what so just, would dictate that? Yeah. Don't, 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 don't ask questions, Jared, because now you're Oh, never, shit, I'm never, sorry, man. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it, it, goes, uh, it goes on the amount of um, backers, um, so uh, the amount they back and, and the amount of backers that you've had. So, you like a frequency um, thing? It, correct, yeah. So oh, we are lucky because cool. we've just launched within the, the last 24 hours. You have a, a larger It ain't luck, Sean. And, it ain't so. luck. It's skill. No, we've put it. We've it's put a, hard, a lot of hard work into this. Yeah, so, yeah you guys got something guys cool really here. Have, man. This, oh, thank you guys. Everything yeah. from top to bottom, Ben, Elfie, Sean, you guys are freaking phenomenal, man. This thing is so tight. It looks so good. Your offerings are fantastic. Your delivery is exquisite. 
I mean, talk about some bad A mother flunkers right here. Oh, Woo! Oh boy. <laughs> Get this guy back. <laughs> I want to see. I want to see a bug magnet villain. <laughs> it's still available, Jared. Let's see it. Hey, I want. Okay, man. Let me just go mortgage something. Go mortgage something and I'll make that happen. Totally worth it. You'll live forever. Yeah, well, I'll live until my wife finds me. <laughs> yeah. I'm on it. I'm working on it. Because I'll tell you what, Bug Magnet, I can, I can think of a few killer villain-like abilities. Abilities? Yeah. Bugs. Yeah. <laughs> minus four, minus four. Just make him crash the game. Like, you flip the card oh, out and the game crashes. Yeah. Right, before they, right before they win, Bug Magnet. Uh, Bam. 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 We, we saw yeah. what the bug magnet can do in that last game we were playing. There you go. Yep. That was a, that was a teaser. <laughs> teaser of the new superpowers. So, Rose Kirby on YouTube. Like, uh, bug like wind condition for bug magnet. That could, that could happen. <laughs> <laughs> Rose Kirby on YouTube says, I normally buy comics at cons, but your lot has made my day. Do you want me to say on YouTube about this when I post? Um, sure. Oh, oh, Why not? I appreciate so awesome, it. Rose. Thank you, Rose. That'd be amazing. Thank you. Yeah, and, and hey, guys. Please share this video out. Share this video out so these guys can get seen and so that people can be going to this Kickstarter and helping them. I know I'm not as cool as Fry and Matt. See, not nearly. But, but please back these guys. This is what it's all about. This is where rubber meets the road. These guys are indie. They're awesome. What they're doing is is really making a difference i mean really making a difference these guys are making it happen and and i've just my head my hat's off to all three of you guys man this is fantastic i have been nothing but impressed and i i will do something to to step up to the awesome level of my my duo here that makes me look bad well and i'm just gonna throw this out there we don't make you look bad man you you oh, make us look God. good I, I, oh thank <laughs> you so I think. Just just Wait. so that everybody's aware, man, this game is so highly addictive that Jared is not a gamer. Yeah, I repeat, I, I had to sit yesterday and explain to him how to install Steam. Let's not so, talk about that, Fry. this guy is not a gamer. Hey, and Jared, I, I, I feel kind of bad on air. You guys have all played. I, I haven't even given Ben access to the game yet. Yeah, I haven't even... <laughs> I haven't even seen the final comic yet. Oh my oh. god! Ben, I'm so... Dude, I'd be pissed at Sean. That's right, I've backed it anyway. I'll get it eventually. Oh, yeah. wait a minute, dude. Oof. Just kill off their characters, bro. You got control. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I would, but the editor created most of the characters, so... Oh. Eh. oh. What do you do then? Uh, guys, I'm, I am so like I, I don't know if we're wrapping up soon. I, I told my partner I'd be done like half an hour, but I'm so I'm so enjoying myself here. That I was happy to stay on well, sorry yeah, about that. we're up to we'll two hours, so we'll end it here real soon. Perfect. Well, just as a thanks to you guys for just hosting such an amazing, uh, amazing, uh, yeah, cast, and and, and it's been so, so great being on here, and so much fun being on here as well. Um, I do want to uh, thank you guys, and give, I'll give all three of you access, and obviously I now have to give it to Ben and Sean, access to our inner server, which gives you um, access to uh, the Infinity Engine Gamma, which is releasing pretty soon, but you guys will get it first, and I'll also give you access to my personal custom heroes folder, which has got what? some 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 not safe for work oh. ones in there as well, but there's a lot of these custom portrait images that you can pop in and replace characters um, in the game. So my partner's been having a lot of fun with that. She's been finding Elfie, some. Did someone <laughs> did, did I did I mention lately that you're my hero? Oh. Thank you, bro. You can, my, you can be my villain. Jared. You're my, you're you're my villain, bro. so awesome. Thank <laughs> you, guys. Thank what, you. What, what'd you say, Sean? I heard you. Are, you. are you feeling a little sad? I'm sorry, man. You're my hero, too. Oh, okay. <laughs> Secondary. Sorry. I mean, you've been um, bumped down a little bit. But Ben is a, ben is a super gamer. I don't know if you can see behind him, but he's a retro collector um, oh, crazy. Damn. Oh, I see an N64 box back there. Yeah, I collect Nintendo things. It's uh, yep. I hate money. I, I just don't like money. And, um, better way. So he's got a child and a Nintendo. And <laughs> so, but, um, well, we, but we, if should, you... we should announce, guys. I mean, much much thanks to some a killer creative director. But we have gone over that limit now, so that means there's those extra comics coming in. Holy crap! Right? We got to make an announcement. Another one, Sean. Do it. 
Yep, so uh, the two comics that we'll add in uh, to this one is uh, Ichabod Jones by Russell Nolte. Uh, so that is actually up on Kickstarter at the moment for the second um, second issue. So uh, you can, you'll can you get that free for every single backer, $9 and above. Uh, and we're also going to throw in Night Wolf issue one. So uh, we are super excited um, that we've got a, a great great group of comic creators that have uh, given us their issues uh, so that we can give more value to the people that back out. That's uh, awesome. What, what's, so, that, what's, what, what's Night Wolf? What is, what is, what is this, Sean? I'm not... It's, a, it's another comic. Like, another indie comic, yeah. You, you yeah. did it or like... Pe- someone else people are going to find out because they're going to back the Kickstarter and they can check yeah. it out. Yeah. So, so oh, no, am I am I asking too many questions again? No, 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 that's all right. We've we've all got right. a group of um different creators that I um I put the call out when the the Kickstarter went live and asked if they would be willing to share some of their own works to give more value to to my backers and oh. or to our backers and everything. So they were kind enough to to share some of their PDFs um, cool. for us to, to add. That so at the awesome. nine dollar level, we had uh, we had three. Um, because of the the great uh, backers on this show, we've now gone over that limit. So you'll get now five for that nine dollars. So we'll do an update on the Kickstarter in a sec. And um, I think if we can hit three thousand by the end of the weekend, we'll add another two on on top of that as, oh, as that well. Oh, that is so, so freaking cool! Um, so yeah, so so the 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 more more we get, the more we we give. So um, and that's that's because we've got so such giving. a great group of. Uh, of comic creators um, out there, so. But I want to also say thank you very much for for uh, doing this, uh, having this event. Um, you know, it was great to, to be able to market this to, to the US in this way and and to show off the game and and really try and show our passion for for this uh, this project. So thank, thank you very much, guys. For thank you guys for letting us be a part of it, man. This yeah, I, I what you guys are putting together honor. is amazing. This has been our our pleasure, Absolutely. our honor. You guys are freaking awesome what you guys are doing. Th- thank you for allowing us to be a part of your magnificent rocket that is launching into space and is just going to, you know, I don't know what rockets do after I have no idea where he's going to go with it. Speaking, <laughs> <laughs> we're just going to let him keep going and we're going to roll the outro. Guys, if you want to stay on the stream for just a minute, we'll run over the numbers when it's done. And thanks everybody for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Follow along. Yeah. Go back to this project!